Hello, everybody, and welcome to another Battleground Games Live! Hello! Welcome to The Loft at Battleground Games and Hobbies in Abington, Massachusetts. Uh, for those of you joining us for the first time, Battleground Games and Hobbies is your friendly local game store in the greater Boston, Massachusetts area with three locations. One up in Saugus on Route 1 by the Fuddruckers, one down in Norton by the Xfinity Center, and one here in Abington, uh, the OG location, so to speak, uh, although we have moved down the street from where we used to be. Anyways, uh, <laughs> this location has a convenient loft from which we can stream, and that's what we do. Every Friday, we get together and we stream different board games. Uh, mostly board games. We've done some mostly card games, games and stuff. Yeah. And Table yeah, toppy sorts of things. Table toppy sorts of things. I want to do more stuff on stream. Amanda occasionally paints. Sometimes. Uh, my name is Andrew. Hi, everybody. Welcome again. Uh, with me today, I have. Hello, everyone. I am John. Uh, I'm excited to play any game based on a movie I enjoy. <laughs> and I'm Amanda, and I am uh, getting warmed up by eating some goldfish. Yes, Amanda will be playing the shark. The nom, nom, nom. eponymous jaws, so to speak. Uh, I, I think it's fun to bring up that um, throughout our streams, we've had a few games where one player plays a bad guy. And everyone else plays a different character. Yeah. Andy was the vampire in Fury of Dracula. That was I so much fun. Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna come up most definitely because that was amazing. Well, I played yeah. uh, the Demon Lord in the Descent, uh, and Travis, our friend, uh, we miss you, Travis. If you ever come back, bro, we're waiting for you. Uh, we're going to do. Um, uh, he did a uh, uh, what was it called the the dexterity game? Uh, Catacombs. 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 So Catacombs. it brings it full circle with Amanda finally getting to play a big bad. I've even got a special meeple. Uh, yes, special the shark token. meeple is awesome. It's got a big mouth. So cool. You'll get to see that when we eventually get to the game itself. Yeah. yeah. Um, for those unfamiliar with the format of this program, uh, we are not so much doing a learn to play or yeah. a watch and play. We play yeah. games and we hang out with our friends in chat. Mm -hmm. and get things wrong. We get things wrong. We're often learning to play games. Uh, today, John has watched the Learn to Play for Jaws. I have. And I've read the instructions. So between the two of us... I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> and Amanda's here, too. Um, <laughs> I'm just excited to eat things. Yeah. <laughs> Good that you're, you've mastered it already. I feel like that's the only mindset I need as a shark. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, we often get things wrong. If anybody in chat notices us missing a rule or something like that, just hop in there and point it out to us and we'll try and correct it. Oftentimes, we notice things towards the end of the stream. Like, oh, oh that was wrong the whole time. <laughs> oh, guys, that ability that I've been using. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't really work that way. <laughs> um, I also have an announcement for next week. My father and possibly other family members will be joining us again. Awesome. So we have to think of a game that involves lots of people. But yeah, ponder that. Ponder that. Today, we're playing Jaws. So this just came out two weeks ago, and it's had some really good buzz. Mm -hmm. And uh, shift my microphone. Okay. Um, it's like pulling my shirt. Um, so yeah, this game had some really spectacular buzz, and was, uh, it sounded fascinating to me, and John texted me earlier this week saying, what are we playing on Friday? And I was like, well, we've got a bunch of copies of Jaws on the shelf. <laughs> so this is the uh, Abington store demo copy. If you come into the Abington location, you can try this out. Um, I should say, uh, and I've never made a point of this in past streams, but yeah. uh, in our YouTube channel, we're getting more and more folks watching old videos uh, in cool. the YouTube yes. channel. And some of them are asking where they can get the games. Uh, oh, we yeah. have a website, Many of them. but the website is only for Magic singles. We ship out Magic the Gathering cards from our vast yeah. pile of millions of Magic cards downstairs. Um, if you want to buy board games from Battleground, you have to come into the stores because uh, the shipping costs on board games can often be prohibitively expensive. 
You can't ship them media mail. I wish board games were considered media mail, but that's strictly books. Uh, so we can ship board games, media, cowards. We can ship RPG books, and we have yeah. listed RPG books when we've done RPGs on stream, um, but we cannot ship board games, unfortunately. So if you want board games, come on in and enjoy our vast selection find, of board find games. Find your most local Battleground Games hobbies. Maybe and we uh, make the boxes look like books, like the Hexplorer games, <laughs> and then you can just ship them out. I'm like that pie Says Piper the guy man. who works yeah. for the Postal Service. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> We make good use of media mail in the library. That's I how we're able to. Yeah. That's how interlibrary loan is actually able to work and not be prohibitively expensive to public libraries that are not funded um, exorbitantly. I'll put it. Um, that's how we're able to do that. Is uh, how we're able to like ship stuff all around the country because we do that. Check out your local public library. It's also. Um, Hello, Novocaine. Yes, he's hey. got the, the exact thing going on. Uh, well, I was doing it into my mic earlier. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, um, Novocaine, I enjoyed seeing in the Discord your uh, Star Wars figures. Ooh, he's got a oh, vast collection of Empire, um, nice. including a whole bunch of the Emperor's uh, guards. So, I have a question. Okay. Speaking of movies. Yes. And movies and shark. Mm -hmm. um, and this question can go for Novocaine as well, and anyone else watching. Um, and I did pose this to my friends yeah. earlier, and so that they would have some time to think. Favorite non Jaws or Jaws sequels shark movie? Okay. Uh, do you mind if I go first? Go ahead, yeah. All right. I, I gotta go for the good, the classic. You ate my damn bird, the deep blue sea. Sure, sure. So, yeah. Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Nova Dane agrees. agrees. Deep blue sea. Deep uh, blue sea. I it's have a sure. very specific reason, though, for very much enjoying that okay. movie. So, uh, uh, I don't know if we want to go into details for the movie, but oh. a very hype. Jen the says the Jen. Meg. Oh, the Meg, okay. I have yeah. not seen the Meg. Remind me, Andy, we need to give Novocaine a welcome message. You're yes. so right. Why is a regular not one? So we need yeah. to add you to the bot. Yes, most definitely. The bot is like over at the far end of the table, so we'll have I can't to do that it. later. Yeah. But we will do it later, Novocaine. You you are a regular. You you deserve a welcome. Mm. Uh, uh, so uh, <laughs> the reason I enjoy it so much is because I, I, uh, I, I kind of like... There's that one scene no one expects in Deep Blue Sea. If you've yep. seen Deep yep. Blue Sea... And Are we avoiding spoilers on a movie spoilers. that's like two decades old? Yeah, because, because that is the one thing the movie's got. Yeah, it, it, it may not have a lot going for it, but it's got that. Um, I so liked it as a movie because it played with well-known horror tropes. Oh, yeah. And this was a while back. <laughs> yeah, and this was like well before playing with those well-known horror tropes in a big movie was a thing as much. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, yes, maybe. Finding Nemo <laughs> says Novocaine. That's a good suggestion. Uh, um, but yeah, the reason I enjoy it so much is because it turns out that that scene is specifically there because that's what the the scene that it involves... I, I can't say this yeah. the exact way, but basically he agreed to it just for that. Nice. And that's all nice. I'm going to go on that's that. That's awesome. Nice. Yeah. Um, all right, so I've got a number of options because Amanda and I, you, you're familiar, yes. John, with the fact that we oh, did the movie goodness. project. I, I project. looked out and watched actually, a lot of different. Aside shark from movies. 2016, every year has had like a high profile shark movie. Yeah. In the past, like since forever. Yeah, there's Except been a for lot 2016, of and I don't we know did, why. We did, as part of the movie project, Shark Week, I think twice. Yeah, we did oh it twice. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, where we watched a whole ton of shark movies on shark we during Shark Week. So many shark movies. Uh, and I'm going to say there's probably three standouts. Okay. Maybe four. I'll, I'll accept three. Go for three. Um, because. And then we'll, we'll, we'll find out what your runner-up The is. absolute best worst shark movie yeah, that we gold had. the standard best the one you worst talk shark about movie. Is times. Sharks in Venice. Sharks in oh Venice. Mind-bogglingly bad, but not so bad that it's awful. Yes. So bad that it's fun. It's, sharks it in is Venice is a truly terrific bad movie. In case you're wondering what the plot of Sharks in Venice is, you already know. Yeah. You know the title. 
It's got a lesser Baldwin in it. A very lesser Baldwin these days. Yeah. Lobster Lesser Revenge! Hello! Shark Week was something else. You blame being British? <laughs> so Shark Week can also be used as a euphemism <laughs> for a certain week of the month for many... Okay. Shark people. Week. I get you. I get you. <laughs> uh, is it that sharks are in Rome? Yes, Jen, you figured it out. Da, 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 so da. there's a couple of great bits of sharks in Venice. So good. Uh, it's got awful CGI. Venice, yeah. It's got awful comp compositing. <laughs> it's got sections right. where people are swimming <laughs> with rebreathers in their mouths, talking to each other. <laughs> like it, all the dialogue is dubbed. The oh, entire yeah. movie is dubbed. <laughs> yeah. And there are sections where people are swimming underwater, and you hear them talking to each other, and I'm like, but they've all got their rebreathers in. How are they talking? <laughs> it's just mind-blowingly bad. Completely incongruous stock footage, mm -hmm. where you're like, "That's not in a canal in Venice," and I know that. That's like in a tank in an aquarium. <laughs> Ooh, they're asking it's if it's hilarious. worse than Samurai Cop. Uh, in a similar vein to Samurai yeah. Cop, I'd say Samurai Cop is more professionally made. Than sharks and <laughs> Samurai Cop has higher production <laughs> values. <laughs> There's a point where, um, in theory, the lesser Baldwin is on is like is in the back of a boat that like floats up to that like drives up to to a window because uh, apparently in oh, Venice they don't have doors with stairs, um, and it it floats up and he cr he climbs through the window into the into the room that the scene is taking place in and it is laughably obvious that it is not a boat but a pickup truck oh my god yeah, it's just so that's that's the gold standard for so good at very bad, bad movies CGI water. so bad it's good okay. yeah like it, made this in photoshop <laughs> water the production values are about on us on a par with early 90s um CD-ROM games. What year yeah. did the movie officially come out, though? I don't know. Amanda will look that up. While she does that, we'll talk about other shark movies. Okay. Uh, I have a great fondness for Dino Croc versus Super Gator. I guess that's not sharks. The way you've always described sharks and Venice, I thought this was a VHS movie. Oh, no! Oh, my God. No, this came out on DVD, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> and when... when if you <laughs> You'll know you found it because there's a gondolier and a shark. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus um, God. So sharks in Venice. Um, oh, I'm sorry, Novocaine. No one should have to do that. What happened? Oh, the As prequels. part of his Pie! research, he watched some of the Star Wars prequels. Oh, there's there's a war rewards again for yeah. bits. Oh. What's going on with bits now? I hope you uh, I hope you can still enjoy. Pears. I want to give rewards. I really hope you can still enjoy you know, Pears, Nova Cain. Neat. What? That, what that's is awesome. that? It's it's fighting ramen. Ooh. I got ramen that's fighting. That's amazing. Ramen fighting. Um. Is there a new yeah, event going? Yeah, the CGI going? in the pre in the in the Star Wars pre prequels did not age well. Um, yeah. Everyone knows yeah. the pair. We can. You know what, Nova Cain? We can. Um, we can discuss. How bad the prequels are at some other time. Yeah. But now, returning sharks. to bad shark movies. Yeah, or Dino other Croc vs. Super Gator does not count. There is okay, no shark, no shark. Okay. in it. But I would highly recommend it because it is so hilarious. And the commentary it's track well with Roger Corman. Oh, yeah. beautiful. Beautiful. Man, fantastic. Yeah. Amazing really yeah. and everything. Um, but on a related Corman note, uh, Octoshark. Is oh, that Octoshark. What it's called? Yes. Um, which is Sharktopus? Sharktopus. 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 Which is a movie clearly made to be bad, but still it's decent. Nice. Because <laughs> <Like, laughs> it's Corman. Yeah, because it's Roger Corman. Because it's Corman. Well, I mean, <laughs> the interminable number of uh, Sharknado movies. Yeah. Yes. Uh, which were made to be bad movies, they're just bad. They're, more they're not fun. At you than with you. Whereas yeah. Sharktopus. It's laughable. It's actually a fun movie. It's it's, it's fun it, to watch. Yeah, and it, Corman knows how to make a, a cheesy monster movie. Yeah. he's good at it. So I enjoy Sharktopus a great deal. Um, yeah, Sharktopus is great. But I know Amanda and I agree on this. 
um, Spring Break Shark Attack. Spring Break Shark Attack. That would oh. be my pick. Oh. This is a movie that was not at all what we were expecting. We it, thought we knew what we were getting with this movie. Yeah. Because I'm in agreement. This is the one I would say. Yeah. Um, we thought we knew what we were getting. And the first scene, like the, the teaser scene before the opening like credits, is 100% what I thought it was going to be. Um, we, we thought this is going to be about scantily clad women in like bikinis mm -hmm. getting eaten by sharks and a lot spring of spring break shark attack that's what you expect yeah it's going to be like a spring it's going to be like mtv spring break and that, but with sharks that's what it's going to be there may be some semblance of a plot involving like a romance and they have to get away from the shark but that's that's what it's going to be it's going to be sharks eating like girls in bikinis that's what we're going to get and that's the first scene. Mm -hmm. And then that is not the rest of the movie. Is this At all? Without any of the is this the one where, with the hillbillies? No. Yeah. No. Okay. So the, the movie is actually a lot deeper than you would expect from a movie called Spring Break Shark Attack. And we're not saying it's the Mariana's Trench. No, no, no. <laughs> it's like, it's a stream at most. But we but expect it's not, a trickle. Yeah. Um, the the sharks in the movie are not necessarily the the shark. The bad guys are not the sharks. Right. Okay. Uh, there are. It's got an the entire are, are date rape subplot. Yep. Uh, it's like well handled. Very well handled. And the shark is the evil guy who's trying to um, drug her drink. Way. Yeah. Okay. Um, it it's it like draws a parallel between sharks and abusive men. Yeah, it's a fascinating movie that was not what and, we expected. And they solve everything with science, real, legitimate science. Okay. Like, on the cheesy side, it has one of my favorite shark attack. Special effects. Special effects. <laughs> Whenever somebody is eaten by a shark, because this was a made-for-TV Disney film. Um, Disney? It was Disney Channel. What? Um, what? Yeah. What year? <laughs> but rather than having a lot of gore or it's shark makeup... It's only got makeup, two stars. God, um, that's what's so the, bad. What's what the happens... Tomatoes? When somebody is attacked by a shark in this movie, they go underwater, yeah. and then there is a blood geyser that shoots <laughs> up out of the water <laughs> to imply that they've been torn asunder by sharks. It's hilarious. No. It's a it's a whopping thirty two percent audience score. Yeah. <laughs> and no critics reviewed it. No. No critics have touched the movie. Anyways, um, Spring Break Shark Attack. I, okay. I don't believe it was a Disney Channel movie. There's no way. One it was definitely the, made one for cable. One of the main characters. Um, and I want to say it was Disney. She like it wasn't reads Nickelodeon. Harry Potter on the beach at one point. The, the male lead like makes sure that no one assaults her. Yeah. Because he's actually a decent guy. Okay. Um, it's, it, the whole plot hinges on a shady real estate developer trying to drive sharks into a popular cove in order to drive people out of that cove and into a cove that he has a lot of money invested in. That, that's that's the, a legitimate plot! That's the same kind of plot. I know you haven't watched it yet, but you remember uh, Croc? Yes. Uh, very similar concept, where they're trying to blame this Croc sanctuary for all these crocodile attacks, with a brace-faced mogul trying to basically force them out. Andy, there is no mention of Disney anywhere in this. No. This is not a Disney why channel. Did you I don't say know Disney? why you would imagine. It was a von Zernick Sertner Films <laughs> and Film Africa Worldwide because it was filmed largely in Cape Town. Oh, cool. Oh, okay. Um, Anyways, it's, that, that it's legitimately is my a really. It's actually a really surprise fun movie. pick if you, for if you shark stomach movie. Sort of the 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 plot with the like assault, the potential assault. He doesn't actually do anything. Mm -hmm. He does drink her, we, drug her drink, and she does yeah. drink it. Um, but that's why we actually think it was well handled. Because okay. it's it's a case of, here's this shady guy doing something really skeevy, and no one actually gets hurt by it, and he gets his comeuppance. 
and I really appreciate that. It's a, a well-done movie. So... It shocked us. Today we're <laughs> playing Jaws. <laughs> yes. Which they, is, in uh, fact, based on a shark movie. Legitimately and actually good. And Jaws, <laughs> it has a reputation, and it's well-deserved. It is the movie that... Um, is this had a non the, a limited non-US theatrical release before going into the movie? Aww. Was it supposed <laughs> to be a, was it a foreign film or was yeah. it a well Cape Town? It was, it was, it was made in Cape, Cape Town, Town. It was South African. Okay. Um, was there any telling of like did anyone have an accent in the movie? No. No? No, not really. Okay. <laughs> so most disappointing shark movies? Oh Hammerhead. A Hammerhead. Lot. Oh my god, that movie was such a letdown. Yeah, Hammerhead oh, was so sad. I was like, it's a guy who's trying to genetically engineer a shark human hybrid and it gets loose. And I'm like, this sounds amazing. We need it. And then we watched it and we were like, this is just bad. This isn't fun bad. It's just boring. And then there was Megalodon with, um, what's his name? Not Sorbo. It was one of those TV action heroes from the 90s. Um, but it wasn't I, Kevin Sorbo. I have to disambiguate it to figure out. <laughs> <laughs> um. But Megalodon had a number of scenes filmed supposedly... It didn't even have a, good, a big name in it. No. It was like Robin Sox. <laughs> um, supposedly filmed in, in a submarine, but obviously filmed in somebody's basement. <laughs> It was just <laughs> so it, it. It's bad. Yeah. Anyways, <sighs> on to oh, yeah, a good Sorbo. shark movie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, a lot of distance. Anyways. Uh, Am I going to be gone? And yes, I get to be the shark tonight. Yes. Amanda. I'm going to eat swimmers. It's gonna yes. Be great. You don't goal. start with any swimmers on the board. No swimmers on the board. Okay. Mm, but I'm so hungry. Amanda, before we start. You must choose a location where the shark is and, and write it in your little shark tracker. I have a little booklet. For the purposes of this, I'm going to turn my chair to be okay. at this angle. I have a booklet. My booklet like has this. a little map on it of the island so that I can see. Yeah, we're going to need a bigger board. That, so the thing is, it does have <laughs> a Literally, the board is so small. You know what's surprising, though? Out of all the boards we've had on this uh, stream, this one is actually showing the most detail, I think. Yeah, yeah a lot of I detail. I moved the camera way down because I was trying to get it as close to the board it as I could. It's actually it does really nice. Information. I get to move without them knowing where I'm moving. Um, so I have my little thing, and I get to say what location I'm going to, where I'm starting, and then what location I'm going to through 10 rounds. Mm -hmm. um, and then I have my shark power tokens. Oh yes, before we start, we should review the shark powers, because yeah. everybody has to, to be clear on what she can do. Each okay. one of them once. Um, is it once per round or once per Once per game. Once per game. Once per game. Okay, so they have gotta be very careful. So the thing with the shark powers is, <sighs> when she uses a shark power, she just tells us that she's using a shark power. She does not tell us which one it is. And we have to infer from what happens on the board what she did. So, so Amanda, tell us what the abilities you have. First, I have a question. Oh, sure, yes. So if I'm choosing a location, I'm choosing for the numbers? Any, uh, any ocean space, which all have numbers or letters. So there's North Beach N, cool. East Beach E, South Beach S, West Beach W. And, and then, then there's one, two, three, and four, which are the deep ocean spaces. And then there are five, six, six, seven, six, seven, and eight, okay. which are all yeah, yeah, civilization. Nom, nom, nom. All right, I'm um, going to go to the overhead shot so that folks. It can is see very the much board. like Scotland Yard. Yes, it is that that type of a game, that hidden information -y type of game. Okay. Okay. All right, so you know where I'm going. You know where you are. I do. Excellent. We do not. So no, I no. have a little shark meeple. Yes. It looks like a shark mouth. Uh, show it over cover. here. Um, there you go. And I have. It actually shows up. Four we can see special shark abilities bum, bum, because bum, bum, I'm a special bum, bum, shark. Bum, 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 yes, it's a shark hole. Yay! Shark hole. Uh, so she is not necessarily in space one. She was just displaying the shark meeple on the board. So yeah, no, I was just showing off. Um, so my abilities are speed burst. Once this round, the shark may move up to three spaces with one move action. Okay. 
speeding frenzy. For one action, the shark may eat all swimmers at a beach. Yeah, that's an interesting fake out. So if there were two swimmers on a beach, she could eat both of them as two separate actions or use her shark ability to eat all of them in one action and then swim with the other two actions. So, yeah. Pretty good. Evasive moves. The shark does not trigger any motion sensors this round. So that would be any of these uh, buoys that are in the water. And out of sight. The shark is invisible to Hooper's fish finder and Brody's binoculars. Right, so if Hooper uses the fish finder or Brody uses the binoculars and you have used out of sight, what we're going to ask you is, are you in one of these spaces? And you just say no. Yep. Even if you are, you say no because you used that ability. So I have a little, in my booklet, it has a little column for power tokens and I would circle which one I'm using mm -hmm. so that I know that I can't use that again. Yeah, Perfect. and you'll give up the little token, you'll give up the... So if I, but if I give up the token, you know I've used an ability. You tell us when you use an ability, you just don't tell okay. us which one it is. And this way you say, I'm using if, a special ability But then if now. you say, are you here, and I say no, and you know I've used an ability. You might have swum fast that round. You might have. You could have moved three spaces. Yeah. Good point. All right. You cool. might have used move silently so that you don't trigger buoys. Yeah. So how do we do this now? Do what is it? Barrels? Is it one character I'm shark? One character shark? One character shark? But they look nope. so delicious. Oh. So this game is played in two phases. The first phase is Amity Island. Amity means friendship. Amity means friendship. Amity <laughs> means friendship. Uh, during <laughs> this phase, the three of us, which is John as Hooper, hey! John and myself together as Brody, and myself as Quint, are attempting to tag the shark twice, which is to say we have to get barrels to Brody, or I'm sorry, to Quint, and Quint needs to fire those barrels into the shark. Um, yes. Hey unrelated to any of this but um d23 just announced moon knight as a thing Ooh, so very oh. fancy fancy very very excited it's going to be an original series from marvel studios only on disney plus so our goal is to get two barrels fired into the shark if we succeed that's the end of this phase and we go to hunting the shark on the water okay amanda's goal as the shark to is everyone. to eat as many people as she can. If she successfully eats nine yeah. swimmers, that is the end of this round, and we go to the second half. So I've got a question for you. Yeah. Yes. I have my four shark yes. special powers. Mm -hmm. What does shark abilities mean? That is in the second round. Oh, okay, so cool. if you've eaten more swimmers, you get more abilities in the second half. I get to do more stuff. We're going right. to get decks and, and cards get next fewer, round. Neat. We get fewer abilities to fight you with. I'm into it. So the, the more swimmers you eat, the more powerful you are in the second half of the game. I'm, I'm going to eat so many people. All right, so uh, I'll let you choose game... which show up. <laughs> Except for this one. This one's only card specific. Yeah, that's yeah, Brody's specific. son. Yep. All right, so the way the game works is it's played in rounds. Yep. Each round is... Um, three pieces. First, something happens on the island. We'll play an Amity uh, event. Uh, then so hard to eat them Amanda makes her tables. decisions but does not re reveal what her decisions are. She does remove any swimmers that she eats, so we know that she's eaten swimmers in that location, okay. but we know nothing else. You know I about was there what, at one point. Right. Mm -hmm. Once we've got some barrels floating around the island, if she moves into a space with a barrel, she has to put her little charcoal there, to, but she doesn't have to tell us when it happened in her turn. Okay. So on her turn, she gets three actions. She can move, she can eat, and she can use shark abilities. Um, movement is always um, mm -hmm. adjacent spaces, never diagonally. Mm -hmm. The rule book says this like seven times. <laughs> and since so you're a shark, you can never enter the island space. Yes, you can't go into the land. Um, but East Beach is adjacent to mm, but eight. I want a barrel. We'll <laughs> give you barrels. They're coming. Yeah, they're, you'll get them. Uh, um, I guess we so should. So then after the shark 
makes her move and decisions and reveals anything that she has to reveal, then we make our moves. So Each character moves all of their things, takes all four of their actions in one piece. So we can't have Brody do one thing, then Quint do one thing, then Brody do another thing. Gotcha. We have to, but we can do them in any order. So, uh, just to explain, I guess, what Hooper's ability is, if I use the Shark Finder, I put it on the board where I am, you have to tell me in, like, which direction you are from it? No. Is that right? Just if it detects her either in the space that it is in or in an adjacent space. So it would be one west N, and if you could go on land. Yeah, she can't go on land. Uh, So, yeah, Brody's... No, Brody, uh, uh, Hooper. Sorry, I am bumping Use the fish right. finder. Place the fish finder token in the water in your space. The shark must announce where they are in relation to the fish finder. Andy, can you mute me for a second? Um, if the shark is in the same space, they must tell you. If the shark is in an adjacent space that is connected by water, they must tell you they are nearby. Okay. Not which space they're in, just that they're okay. nearby. Unmute me, Andy. If the shark is in neither the same space nor an adjacent space they must tell you they are not there or nearby so as an example if i said adjacent this would be next to this would be next to this would be next to and this third one would be nearby was that nearby or is that so if if you placed it here yeah if she was in uh is that north beach no that's five that's That's five five. if she's in five she would say i'm there and she'd put her charcoal there Uh uh-huh if she's in North Beach, one or West Beach, then she is nearby. Okay. Otherwise, she is. We do not detect anything. Okay. Likewise, if she's using Silent Running, she is undetectable with the Fish Finder. For that round, yep. Okay. So that's your special ability as Hooper. Yep. Um, Brody has two special abilities. One is he can use his binoculars if he's on a beach. Uh, and when he uses his binoculars, um, to identify uh, locations nearby, right? Uh, like that's Fallout. <laughs> right. No. So if he's on South Beach, he can use his binoculars. Right. And if Amanda is on South Beach, she has to say, "I'm there." Mm-hmm. Uh, the other one being uh, the cool one: he can close beaches if no swimmers are there. Yes. And the next time a so swimmer would he go there... He can only do that from the mayor's office or from the police department. Okay. But from one of those locations, he can close any of the four beaches. Can there only be one beach closed at a time? Yes. yes. So if he cool. closes another beach, the beach closing sign gets yanked out of there and placed in another beach. Uh, the first time a character it's would go to that beach, nibble. it flips. I'm not chomping legs. Opening soon. I'm just uh, nibbling next time, toes. And then the third time the character's played. Yep. Alrighty. Quint's really special ability is like he can fire barrels into his space or an adjacent space. So if I, I'm playing Quint, if I have a barrel on my boat and I believe I know where the shark is, I can fire a barrel. If I successfully hit her, she... Hokkaido, welcome. Oh, welcome. yes, and using a little shark emote. A, a That's little very fish appropriate. emote, very nice. Um... So yeah, if Quint fires a barrel into the shark, it's a hit. If we get two barrels into the shark... That ends Act 1. That ends Act yeah. 1. Um, uh, if you eat if nine people... Quint misses the shark... <laughs> yay! Rainbow flying trout fish! Oh my god. Um, if Quint misses the shark, the barrel remains bobbing in that sector. Uh-huh. And then if the shark goes through that barrel, she has to tell us that that barrel moves. Yep. And put her Doesn't shark there, right? Well, no, because she might not necessarily be in that space anymore. If she moves through it on her turn, it would bob the barrel. Can we pick up any barrel that's in the water? Yes. Okay. Because otherwise we we only only got eight eight shots. All right. Are we ready? Shall we do this? I think so. I think we've covered everything. Are you ready? Here we go. First event of this game is... Helicopter. So we get two swimmers on North Beach... Okay. Amanda Which one do you whatever want? Whatever swimmers you want. We were looking at the art on the swimmers before we started the stream, and we think most of the art is actual folks from the movie who get eaten by the shark. Yeah. Each of the swimmers has a unique art. So two on North Beach, oh two God. on East Beach. Okay. 
Okay, there's a lot of people. <laughs> and one on West Beach. Oh my gosh. All right. Okay. And it says, Brody may immediately move to any space on the island. Brody, that's both of us are playing Brody. Yes. Do we want to move to another space? Uh, at I this mean, point, the only thing he could do with that space would be to close South Beach. But there'd be Correct. no point of doing that, I think, with this Well, point. I mean, it might be worth closing a beach. Um, we're I definitely going to want to start grabbing barrels and dragging them to the dock. Let's move them to the store. Okay, we're going to move Brody to the store as a free action. All right. See, that's so what that I'm saying, Jen. A kid, a a kid in an inflatable fills you up too much to eat. The inflatable is empty calories in that it is literally empty. And um, you don't get nearly as much, but you've, you've filled up on, like, plastic. Yeah, exactly. And there's um, flavor on the cards. Nice. I just want to eat the ones on the inflatables. But the inflatable, I, you know, it's like parsley. You've got to get rid of it. Yeah. I was thinking for a second you were actually talking about real snacks. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, what are these inflatable things you're talking about? And then I'm like, they oh, start okay. serving meals just on inflatable cushions. Yeah. Um, I have to floss. My <laughs> little fins can't hold floss. No, like you're unwrapping a Twix. Your teeth just <laughs> fall out, don't they? And they get they replaced immediately. Mm. Yeah, but that's not flossing. I guess. Yeah. Um, okay. And the the flavor quote is, "I can do anything. I'm the chief of police." All right. Is that from the second movie? No. This makes me want to watch Jaws. Oh, it so yeah. makes me want to watch Jaws. Hundred percent. All right. So yeah. now I believe Amanda, you get yes, to do your. Yes, that is three correct. Actions. She makes her three actions and notates them on her, her thing there. Okay. If any people are eaten, you remove them from the board and move your people eater track up on your card. It feels like since it's only nine characters, this could go by either extremely fast or slow, depending on. Yeah, the, I'm uh, actually curious to see how draws. long this game runs. Uh, obviously, when we're streaming, our games take a longer time than it, if you were sitting and playing with friends, oh, yeah. kitchen table or whatever. Because uh, we spent a lot of time talking. And, but I think this is going to be a relatively quick game. If it ends up taking Feels like it. a long time to play the Amity Island Act 1, we can come back next week and do Act, Act two. 2. All right. So um, I have eaten a swimmer. Uh -oh. uh, where at? Or do we not know which one it is? No, she'll remove the swimmer from the board. It's a little kickboard. Oh, just, God. I just let it just <laughs> float to shore. Tommy, no. And all it has is blood oh, fingerprints okay. on it. I should have gone to this. Oh, watch out, Flash. <laughs> uh, so, okay. Yeah, yeah, that kickboard is gone. All right, gone. so. So, John, we know just a bloody already. bloody smear. She was in West Beach at some point. She gets yeah. three moves. She did not use a shark ability. <laughs> okay. So, so if she started at West Beach, the furthest away she could be is four, ne, ne, or there. I mean, there's a lot she could there's get. There's a lot to. she could get to. There's a lot I don't have to go to out to the sea to move. Do no, I? I no, no, no. You could go along the shore. Just cool. uh, this moves faster. Like West Chum Beach. Chum the water with children. That's the plan. Seven, oh, Jesus. Uh, you can't just jump the island. I'm a children. No, she can't go over the <laughs> island. <laughs> you really? The island. All right. All right, so that's what her move was. Now it's yeah. our turn to do stuff. I think we need to start with Brody. Okay. I really feel like we need to get some barrels to us. You can only take one at a time, right? Correct. Yeah, right. He, he grabs a barrel and he drags it. So grabbing a barrel is an action. So he takes Grab a barrel. One yep. action. And then he Second can move action. to uh, move a space as one action. He could just drag a barrel to you at the dock. There are a lot of inflatables on here. Or he could move two here. spaces, bap, bap, and drop a barrel at my dock. Uh, let's go this way, because I have two movement per movement. So I'm fast. I can you give are you fast. barrels. Yeah, okay. So, so he's going to go there. He'll drop the barrel on the dock. That's three moves so far. He has one more move. Let's have Do you want to go to the Amityville yeah. PD and then be ready to close a beach next turn? That sounds like a smart move. Okay. All right. What do you want? Or oh, I'll go next since I have sure. a barrel. Sure. Hooper's got a barrel. I pick up a barrel. And you've got your fish finder. For one action. Uh, is the fish finder uh, a once a game thing, or can you do it every round? Once per round. Once per fish round. Fish finder. Okay. All right. I'm going to use for my action one, or should I use it to pick up people? 
as an action, I can rescue a swimmer. Yeah. Is it more helpful for us to start picking up these swimmers before we get the barrels to each other? I feel like if she's moving towards North Beach, that might be a good idea. Grab two swimmers. So that's one, two, three actions. You've got four one more. actions. I picked oh, up. Oh, you I picked, picked up, up a barrel. barrel. My so that's my fourth action. All right. So, I so we know done. nothing about Amanda's location uh, right now. I'll return these to the supply what year for you, Amanda. This game released. This is new, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah. It just two came weeks out. ago. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's two rescue. So swimmers. timely, right? I think I'll rescue some swimmers as well. So I'm, I can only move half as fast as you. A fair number of shark sightings um, off of Cape Cod this year. Yeah, yeah. warming oceans means yeah. that a lot more sharks are north now than used to be. Ooh, yeah. uh, it used to be that Florida got all the sharks, but now we've got a lot of them around here. Anyways, I'm going to take my move. Okay. So one, two, three. Fun fact. Yeah, you're, you definitely are aware of that because um, you're in that area. Again. Fun fact. I was originally planning on being a marine biologist. Really? Yep. Oh, wow. I was going to be a marine biologist. Yeah, you had tornadoes down there, too. Super fun. So it was my in problem. Uh, Hyannis. No, it was in You want to put those back in the supply? Oh, here you are. No, it, um, I know one was in Hyannis, right? I can move one more towards yeah. you, but you're fast enough that you could get to me in one move. Right now, Someone's yeah. trying to send us a message. What could it possibly be about? Ooh. Huh. Huh. Uh, Huh. I think I'm just going to stay where I am. I'm going to waste right. a move. Then we are all set with our actions. Okay, then it is time for Amity event again. Here we go. Hey, guess what? Amity Island in the news. Great. So, so exciting. We get a swimmer at North Beach. Okay. Oh, God. Two swimmers at South Beach. Oh, darn you, Brody. You should have closed the beach. Two swimmers at East Beach, where I am. Okay. Alrighty. And now, Amanda. Uh, wait, wait. There's oh, a special oh, oh. ability here. Any one crew member may take one extra action this round. You. Me? I think you'd be the most efficient. Because okay. I'm going to get you a barrel on my Well, turn. we'll just, when we get to no our turn. Seagulls, okay. Seagulls, okay. Seagulls and the, are evil. The quote for this is... <laughs> Where did that come from? No, Kane said he lives by the sea and he has a fiery dislike for seagulls. Yeah. Yeah, seagulls Same. are bastards. One what? a burger right out of my great aunt's hand once, just gone. So my family used to go sailing when I was younger. Okay. Uh, and seagulls, a, they're super loud. Oh yeah. But b, they would dive bomb you and they would crap on your head to drive you away from their nests. Yep. Oh man, I hate those things. Uh, oh Andy and I God. live literally like within walking distance. I grew up within walking distance of the beach, and we we still live within a, a long longer walk, but within walking distance of the beach. Um, and it's a, a protected beach. It's you know in a bay, a bay, but we still got a lot of seagulls down there. There yeah. are a lot of seagulls down at Wallace. So, anyways. Dive on the cats. Oh gosh, right. Thank goodness our cat is indoors because she would try to fight them. So the, the flavor text for our card right now is a cloud has appeared on the horizon of this beautiful resort community. Is a it, cloud in the shape of a killer shark. I was going to say, is it, is it birds from Dublin? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Why do seagulls fly over the sea? I don't know, Pi. Why do seagulls fly over the sea? Because if they flew over the land, they'd be land gulls. If you just spoil the joke, Pi's going to be so <laughs> mad at you. Let's see. No, no. Because if they flew over the bay, they'd be bagels. Oh, ah! you did it. <laughs> I was close. <laughs> Thank yeah, you, Insidious Pi. Seagulls are large. And, um, yeah. All right, Amanda. Our new cat is, is not as big turn. as I think she thinks she is. This um, game is, this is actually going to be quite challenging for us. That's how all good asymmetric boss games are. Yeah. I think we need to nail her with this barrel if we possibly can. We have to close a beach and we have to uh, get another barrel out to the dock. Well, I've got a plan, sort of. Um, we do split. have an extra move on our turn because of the bad news. I think we should start with Hooper. This okay. Round, this speed. Yeah. 
I agree. I have a map, but I'm finding myself looking at that because this is where all the swimmers are. Yeah, and this doesn't show me point. where the swimmers are. So, yeah. Um, I'm actually wondering. Would it be easier? Can we just for display to turn it this way? Would no, it's more that like if I have to show, like if I'm looking at this, you guys could track my eye movement. Well, yeah, I'm I'm that's why. Um, so eyes. I'm just I'm more like looking at the board to try and look at where everything is, yeah. and then looking down here to like plan. Yeah. So. No, I found when I was playing the killer in. Um, Friday. Last yeah, Friday. last Friday, that I looked at the board entirely too much. Uh, I'm just wondering. These are just. It's so weird that it's so out of focus for a stock photo. Yeah. I'm wondering and if I want to see the, the rest movie. of these. Yeah. I want to see the rest of these to see. Because, uh, uh, yeah. Okay. All right. She All right. has chosen. Did any swimmers get it? No. Oh. No swimmers been at. Ah, that's interesting to me. And no powers were used. I really feel work. like that's she could be anywhere at this point, so you're going to have to use your fish okay, finder. Well, first. Uh, okay. Move two. Yep, that's one movement. Give you a barrel. I mean, I am salivating two movements. at the thought of all these delicious uh, swimmers. Do you want to try and use your fish finder to find her? I'll use the fish finder. All right, so Amanda, if you are in East Beach, you must tell us I am there. I if am you are there. in six, eight, or two, you must say you are nearby. I am nearby. She is nearby. She's oh in six, eight, or two. But she is not in East Beach. For my last action, I will pick up a swimmer. Okay. And there you go. Uh, now, do you want to use Quint, or should we use Brody next? Let's use Brody. I think we should close West Beach. Okay. Or, or Quint could go next, and we could close East Beach, which forces her to move. That's true. Uh, it's up to you. you All you right, so the here's the strategy piece. You have to piece. pick up that swimmer if you want to close East Beach. Exactly. So we can't close East Beach until Quint is already gone. Um, I think we need to use Brody first. Okay. So let's close West Beach. West Beach has been closed. You've got to close the beaches! <laughs> uh, and then let's go grab a barrel. So that's one. One to use the beach. Yep. One two, here, here. three, move four to the dock and drop it. Five. So you're using Use the extra, the extra action. action on Brody. All right. All right. The extra action is gone. Now, Quince. Quince saves a swimmer. It's one action. Moves one space to eight. Okay. Yeah. And four. Fires a barrel into the water. Did I hit a shark? No. I did okay. not hit a shark. So the buoy she is, is the not there. Head. So we know she is in six or two. How many actions did you use? Uh, one, one, two, three. Three. You have one action left. Would you like to pick that barrel back up? No, I'm going to leave it there because okay. if she moves through the space with the barrel, shark. it goes bong, Where bong, bong. Where do you think the shark is? Oh, oh no. no. <laughs> I mean, she could show them. I can tell you where I am. All right, oh, I'm going to move back to East Beach. No. No, no, no. Go to South Beach. Okay, I'll go to South Beach. Go to South Beach. That's the end of my move. Okay. I've done one, two, two three, three, four. A new event happens. All right. Shark alert. Oh, God. Two swimmers at South Beach. Oh, man, South Beach is getting really populated. It's just so nice there. Oh, she's got a We know she's not ability. here, but if she's here, one, two, two frenzy. frenzy. She could eat four people this turn. But then it's obvious. Well, obvious we would definitely know where you yeah. are, but I don't have a barrel. Uh, anyways, uh, so two at South, one at East Beach. So oh. one appears here. Uh, okay, one at East Beach. Yeah, we need a swimmer. Uh, do you mind? Which one do you uh, feel? I, I think this one. Okay. Is that Which the naked one? girl? Uh, East, East Beach. Beach. Uh, oh, no. no. That is, uh, the, that's Waldo. Oh, <laughs> where is Waldo? You're that humming the tune? Yeah, uh, I, it's been in my head the dun, whole dun, time. Dun, 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 dun. All right, all right. Da, da, da. Uh, if the shark's swimmer track is three or lower, oh no, also place one at North Beach, Oh, God! One at East Beach. 
and one at West Beach. One right. does not appear at West Beach because the beach is because closed. the beach is closed. But now the beach is opening soon. That was awful. So well, many swimmers. You know, one one person's misfortune is another person's reward. <laughs> and we have a quint quote here. A oh, quote right. here. This shark swallow you whole. Oh jeez. I will. All right, uh, Amanda, Amanda, you have gets turns. To move. Actually, you know, I could, but I'm not gonna oh, because God. the blood is more dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What, what fun is swallowing whole? Come on. Shark turn. <laughs> Red lights for shark. So there are four here. There's two here and two here. Yes. Yeah. Interesting. Also, I think you should be aware Brody can also rescue people if he's on that beach. Okay. Just so you're there. Yeah, he just grabs them out of the water and drags Get them. out of the water! You get Come out of the water. water! So I have questions about the binoculars and the fish finder and all of that. Once yeah. they've been deployed... It's a once per round It's a once thing. per so round. So basically that's, that's... He can do okay. it again. Um, but it's once once per round, like, turn? Essentially. Yeah. So I can't... Ooh, I can't okay, all right. Move fish Use finder, it. move okay. fish finder. Okay, all right, cool. Glad to know. This amazing technology. So it's difficult getting barrels. Well, I feel like that's the challenge. Yeah. I mean, I can I can pick barrels back up out of the water. I've got a boat hook or something. I just grab it, yank it back into the boat. Yeah. We'll just focus, I guess, on closing beaches and barrels why the hell do we keep bro why does the store not give you a discount <laughs> well, why do we actually have to go to a shop to buy all these barrels i think it's really great game design that this dock is one space away from the shop yep. but this dock is two spaces away from the shop because this is where brody starts yep. or where quint starts and this is where brody st uh, yeah, Hooper Hooper starts. starts yeah so the faster one can but he can't launch them all right. right all right she's done an action she did not use a shark ability i have eaten a swimmer uh oh where from no okay. i was right there so delicious here or here. <laughs> yeah. So, so one she to move moved, in, one to eight a person, and then moved out. Okay. So she could be here, here, or here. Uh, All right. Okay. Who wants to go first? Um. Do, 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 do. You don't have a barrel right now, right? Oh. I feel like. I. Oh wait. This barrel didn't move. No, it did not. So she's here or here? Yes. That's correct. Okay. I think. As long as the barrel didn't move. I don't tell you guys anything. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, how do you dare they be tool users? With their thumbs so one, and their brains. Two, three. Damn it. Oh, oh she's so fast. That's how sharks be, in their own element. Uh, okay. Oh, we're gonna move Brody first. I don't have a strategy out of the top of my head. I was gonna suggest maybe take your entire turn just to pick up four innocent people. I mean, I gotta save some of them at least. Yeah. <laughs> All right. You could leave them to my mercies. It is true. All right, here, here's what we'll do. Off. Here's what we'll do. You know I'm way over on the other side Brody of the island. Brody, go first, okay. right? Okay, what is the plan? With One, so they think. Two, two, three, three. binoculars. Oh, okay. Then if she's on the, in space six. We'll save this one. Okay. Three, three binoculars. Are you in space six? Yeah, I'm in space We six. found her. All right. All right. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, awesome put your shark hole out there. Okay. So we know where she is currently. Uh, he spots her with his, his binoculars. We well, see some blood in the water right and a little fin. He has like, oh, no. One more action he can do, I believe. What? No. One, one two, two, three, three four. four. Okay, yeah, that's he okay. used all of his actions. Okay. But at least we know where she is. 
All right, Quint, just skip the survivors. Well, I mean, she could swim fast. One, two, three. Yep. And then eat two of them. Yes, but one, two, three. That's I all only you have do. three I actions, you know. Oh, yeah. the pain. But you have those awesome powers. All right, all right. So, You're I... You're too far, Quinn. You're too far. I know, far. I'm too far away. I need to grab that barrel again, I think. We need to get a ton of barrels. Why don't you go first, Hooper? Okay, Why don't Hooper, you save that, that swimmer? For one action, I shall save the swimmer. Move twice. For another action, I shall move here. Yep. And then move here for one. That's that's Three, all your actions. Four. Right? Yes. Swimmer. One, two, two three, three, four. Okay. All my actions. And here's your swimmer back. All right. Uh, Quinn. Amanda, how many people have been eaten so far? Two. two Only two? I thought, okay, okay. She has a frenzied. I have not frenzied yet. Yeah. I only ate one. Get that okay. barrel for the love of God. Yeah, I have to. So Don't I'll do it. rescue a person. Just save all four of them. Save all four of them. There's no swimmers on the board except this one. Save them all. Use your entire turn to save all these people. I think that's the best use of your time. Okay. Right now. Okay. I'm going to clear the beach. All right. For Get dinner. Into my boat. Okay. That's my whole turn. Here, here you are. My whole turn saving people. So New hungry. event. New event. So hungry. The 4th of July. Hey, it's the 4th of July. That means summer's over. One in Swimmer each beach. at North Beach, South Beach, East Beach, and nobody and West. West Beach opens. The beach is no longer closed. Uh, before placing swimmers oh. on all beaches, beaches cannot be closed this round. Oh, that's just bad. No, before placing swimmers, open all beaches, because it's the 4th of July. Oh, so there all is All beaches one. have to be open. Yep. No! Yep. <laughs> no! <laughs> if you plan. open the beaches on the 4th of July, it's like ringing the dinner be dinner bell. Delicious dinner. All right, Amanda, All right, so, it is your turn. Yep, it's shark time. She has not used any of her powers yet. And she's already gotten two people of the nine. The nine. And we have utterly failed in getting her. We know where she is right now, but she's not going to stay there. Had you, if we had moved this way, I did, if you... I don't know. We if I hadn't really moved move. towards South Beach, I don't yeah. want to say it that way. I don't want to say it that way because there's literally no way we could have known, unless it was just like luck of the draw, of the three spaces. Yeah, we hadn't found her for two two turns. She could have been anywhere I when no I moved to South Beach. Yeah, I have no idea where she started. So I think I your I fish finder is super useful. That's why it's once per round. <laughs> yeah. Anything that's once per round is super useful. All right. Uh, I can get to you with another barrel. Um, to, I could move toward, no, I don't know. That's whatever. One, two. Uh, we gotta just load Brody up with barrels. Yeah. Brody and your damn barrels. Damn you, Brody. So time-consuming, lugging those barrels Maybe around. Maybe we should just focus on Brody just stacking a ton of barrels on one dock, and then we pick them all up at once. Because it literally pick up all barrels. Yeah, right? yeah, it's take all barrels. I have an important question. Yes. yes. Oh, it's gonna. It'll give away my strategy. Okay, then we won't ask. <laughs> I am it's about one of the shark powers. Oh, uh, I'll give you the instruction manual, Thank and you, you can read about your shark powers. Yeah. There You're are imagining a Donkey Kong version with a shark dodging barrels? Basically what I'm doing. Shark, shark powers. Didn't he have an animal buddy that was a shark in Donkey Kong? Like the N64 games? Um, there were sharks in the um, Donkey Kong Country. Yeah, there was a, the rhino you could use. Yep. The fly. Yep. I thought he swam with a shark, or was it a dolphin? Can't remember. That was a no, lot wow. of wonky waterlubs. Donkey Kong, by the way, on the N64 is some quality gameplay. 
Yeah. Oh my God. That does not fun. answer my question. That's okay. okay. Uh, if you you have a computer, if you need to look up a fact, we can yeah, just turn away. I'm not going to. Oh, there's I'll, there's I'll a fact on the back. Oh, there you go. I don't know if it'll answer her question. I hope to God it does. I hope to God. Smile, you son of a... Oh, hey, guess what? What's that? Um, if a shark swims through a space with a floating barrel, does the barrel get attached to the shark? No. No. Okay. The barrel is attached only if it gets launched into the shark's correct space. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. But so. if you move through a space with a barrel, you have to tell us that you moved through that space. Yeah. Or into that space. Unless you use your shark ability that lets you move through barrel spaces without moving barrels. You somehow make it so the water is deeper, so you just go under the barrels. Guess so. Before they realize what's up. Cool. Okay. Still doesn't answer my question, but that's okay. Okay. Damn you, 4th of July. Damn you. Uh, I, I do agree this board splitting is a great concept. Cool. But my God, just literally the fact that it has a center is annoying. <laughs> yeah. Because it means it's, he's always like three spaces away from anywhere he would need to be. All right. And he's so Shark slow. Shark is coming off the board. Okay. Yep. So she started here. Yep. She's done three things. I've eaten a swimmer. Uh-oh. Where at? All right. So she had to move. Oh, I used a shark token. Okay. Oh, oh no. Okay, okay. She used a shark token. Okay. All right, so she might have swum really fast. She didn't. Um, she didn't use the move through barrels ability. No. Nope. She did not use the feeding frenzy because only one person got eaten. What were the other two? She's one is move really fish fast. Finder. She's right. One is immune finder. to fish finder. I could tr just drop it immediately to see if it works, and if it works, you could say it worked, or if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Yeah. I think fish finder is useless either way. If she moved three from here, she could go one, two, three, uh -huh. one, two, three. three. So she could be as far as there or there. All right, you know what? So if you use the Can fish see finder. The for a second? Yeah. Oh, go ahead. If you used the fish finder and she used the anti fish finder, you'll see nothing. That's fine. If you use the way. fish finder and she moved three, You'll still see nothing. She didn't move. Well, that, with the power booth, she would have moved three. Exactly. But in that idea, I'd rather use it and just get it over with. But why? You're not going to see anything either way. I guess, I guess if so. you see something, it's because she she moved fast but not as fast. Just to be clear, moving fast is literally only movement points that she can use. Is that correct? Right. Okay. And it's three spaces? Yes. Okay. It's as a single move move up to three spaces. All right, I am going to move here. One. Take a dude up. Two. There you go. Here. Three. There you go. Thank you. Four. Cool. Uh, do you want Brody to go, or oh, do you want to go next? red here. Um, I don't think it makes any difference. Okay. So, okay, wait, wait. Maybe Thank use Brody you. first. Okay. Very. From here, yep. she it could have tone. gone one, two, three. Okay. Right? Yep. So can Brody move one to here? Oh no, it only works on beaches. Yeah, only on beaches. You she could can't, save this person. Yeah. That is an option. Or you could save this person. That is also an option. So let's let's uh, let's do that. Does that sound better? Yeah. So one, one, save a person. Two. Maybe go grab another barrel. Or close a beach. Oh, good point. Let's yeah. close. Move to Amity PD. Three. And close East Beach. Does okay. Sound like the good beach, or should we close South doesn't, Beach? Doesn't matter. Okay. East Beach is closed. All right. East Beach is closed. I have moves left. And you have a barrel now. I do have one barrel on my boat. I've already eaten at East Beach. It's okay. <laughs> All right, My so laugh is just getting so <laughs> lazy. It's like the fakest fake laugh, but one, it's so two, lazy. Three. She could be in the space with us. I don't know if she would have done that. Or no. From North they Beach. Don't know. 
Okay. From North Beach, one, two, three. Mm-hmm. One, two, three. So no, she could not be in the space just, with just us. Just launch it. Just this launch it where move. you feel. Yeah. So I'm gonna go to seven. Okay. And fire a barrel into the water in seven. You fire in seven? Yes. That's my second move. I have two more moves. So for my next move, I'll move to West Beach and rescue a swimmer. Were you hit by the barrel? Nope. Okay. Oh, no! I thought I had her. I, I figured you should... Well, if you launch it, does she immediately have to say or say... No, no, yeah. I mean, thank you for, for okay. hanging out and oh, being go. super enthusiastic Good night. about Jaws. <laughs> we very much enjoy the film. Can I see the instructions again? Sure. Should have something. Okay. Well, okay, okay. Why did you think seven of all things... I mean, uh, I okay. just Amanda. I counted from North Beach where she ate somebody. Okay. One, two, three. She might have been in three. She might be in uh, eight. All right. eight. One, two, three. Amanda. She might be in yeah. four. Do me a favor. Remember this turn and remember where you were this turn. Because I want to know if you were actually in South Beach after this game for this round. Sure. Oh, thank you. She couldn't reach South Beach, could she? From North Beach? Even with the speed boost. Well, that might be true. I did eat someone. You did yeah. eat someone. Yeah. So, so she... Starts here, no matter what. One to move here and then eat somebody. Yep. And then she moved up to three. Three spaces. So, bam, bam, bam. One, two, three. You're right. She could be in four. I hadn't even thought of that. And you went to seven. Well, now we've got two barrels floating. They're not at beaches. So. We have a closed beach. We have a closed beach. We have one swimmer available. Oh my God! Why do these? Has people everybody not moved? Oh uh, yeah, everyone's gone. You okay. used your Quint abilities last. I did. We used Brody and we used my abilities. Yep. All right. And you've used another barrel. Real. Oh God! Cardboard fin hoax. <laughs> Where are they at? Where are they at? All right, and there is a swimmer at North Beach, a swimmer at South Beach, a swimmer at East Beach. Nope. Nope. Okay, swimmer at West Beach. Why is there a swimmer everywhere? Again? Move all crew members to the beach with the most swimmers. If tied, the crews cho- the choose which beach to go to. So we all rush to there. Because somebody spotted... Oh, great. Somebody spotted a shark, but no! it was a hoax. Oh, what's the quote? Didn't he made me do it. He talked me into it. Didn't they get like arrested by the FBI or something like that? Uh-uh. I forget what the scene exactly is. But because of that... I just think of the Simpsons scene where the shark fin comes out of the water and it's Homer. And then another shark fin comes out of the water and it's Bart. And Homer goes, oh no, it's a fish boy, (laughs) and runs away. I thought you were quoting the Trias of Horror with the dolphins. Anyways. Uh, All right, so we're all over here at this beach that we know she's not at. You're sure over there. (laughs) That that doesn't help us a great deal. Well, let's see what happens for the turn. All right, so it's Amanda's turn to do something. And that card played against us pretty badly. Well, we'll know if the sensors go off. Yeah, we need to start dumping some sensors in the deeper water. Well, we need more barrels. Yeah. We need a lot well, of Well, I'm barrels. over by the dock now, so... That's true, you Brody can, can go get grab barrels. a barrel and drag it straight to me. He should grab two barrels if he could. You can rescue some people. I want to look at these cards. Because so far we've had three bad cards and two good cards. So I'm wondering if the deck is 100% 50-50. I don't know. I, don't know. I, I can't wait to see. We'll find out. Are you done? I am, and I ate someone. At Ooh. South Beach? No. Or West Beach. No. West Beach. Oh, okay. Okay. All righty. <laughs> she did not use any shark abilities. Nope. So we know one action was to eat in two spaces from where How many people was. is this so far? Four. Four. Four people. <sighs> man. Which means we're only going to get nine gear this, if it stays This is dead. awful. Eight. Oh, Eight. man. Okay, okay. And I get right. five shark abilities. So, if she was here, it's one, two, eat. Well, you know if what? If she was, yeah. What are you doing? Oh, fish finder. Good idea. Fish finder. Beep, 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 beep. 
Are you in my area west? No. Are, are you, you nearby to west? Are you three, yes. seven, or five? Yes. She's nearby, okay. Okay. which means she's in five or three because this barrel did not move. Yep. Okay. Well, that was one action, two actions from Riley. Yes, that was move and fish finder. All right. I'm thinking I'm going to pick up a barrel. Pick up the south beach? No, no, leave the barrel. Okay. Rescue a swimmer. Rescue the swimmer. All right, that's my entire work as Brody. Okay. Uh, no, as Hooper. Hooper, Hooper. Brody's going to drag a barrel. So one, two, three, four. Excellent. All right. I'm now, going to grab that barrel. One, one two. two. Are you going to launch it in five? Well, she's in five or three. Well, then we'll definitely know where she is. By limiting it. Yeah, I can't get it to three, because I've already used two actions. Yep. So yes, I'm going to fire a barrel into five. Bam! Are you there? No. No, okay. but so that's fine. I've got one more move. I'll move to west beach. Maybe I'll just stay there. I'm going to stay there. Do you want to pick the barrel back up? No, I, I feel like getting barrels around is going to help narrow things down. So we know that okay. she's in three right now. Yeah, currently. Okay. Right. Currently in three. Next card. And I suspect that means that that is her fast move. Okay, then next card. But it could be... Later. I don't know. Okay. Bad card. Holiday Roast. Uh-huh. One in North Beach. One in East Beach, which so opens nope. the beach. Yep. Two in West Beach. All right. The docks are under repair. Barrels cannot be dropped at or picked up from either dock this round. <laughs> Man, this game. <laughs> Sharks don't laugh, but if they did, that would be their laugh. You gotta start picking up the We barrels. better catch something. This is my wife's holiday roast, says Charlie. Okay. Well, that limits our options. Well, it just means Amanda's we can't turn. use this guy at all. Oh, boy. I mean, he can grab a barrel and drag it around the island with him. He just can't put it at a dock. Which <laughs> doesn't sound any better. Uh, I have the feeling that three people might be dying this turn. I... I oh, God. Are you doomed to them? Yeah, it's a power. Which means it'll be seven, which means we have two more chances to catch somebody. <laughs> oh, God. Andy, Andy. She knows she, we know she's at three, and she can't move fast. So it. it's one, two, eat, 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 so we know where she is. Yep. Right. But she's eaten three people. So you've used your power, I believe, Hey, correct? guess what? I've used a power. <laughs> I've eaten people three people. No, no, no. Right. <laughs> frenzy. Right. Okay. Three people have been lost. Delicious. So you're up to seven. I have eaten seven people. All right. We're losing this round. All right, so I grab a barrel. Okay. One, two, I shoot her with a barrel. Here, Amanda. Can you not use barrels? Because it's... I can't pick it up off the dock. It's oh, in the water. Oh, okay. Got it. Yeah, so I grab it out of the water, I go to North Beach, I fire it. Amazing! I got Amazing one into the shark. Amazing, you found a shark. <laughs> uh, Andy. Oh, wait, yeah, your ability is once per round. Yeah. So one, two, three, I'll go back. Four. Okay. One, one two, two, three. three. May as well take your fish finder out of there because you can't uh, use it. Four. Fine. Um, Brody, go grab a barrel and close West Beach. One. Well, he can pick up as many barrels as he wants, right? What? No. Pick up a barrel, pick up a barrel, pick up a barrel. Do you want him just to just keep picking up barrels? So we can have them. Two? Or how do you want us to do it? Oh. Yeah, I guess he can carry two barrels at a time. He, he can, can only pick up one at a time. He can pick up one at a time and drop one at a time. Okay. So yeah, one, two, two. to grab a barrel. Oh, then it's three, four three. to close the beach. Yeah. Do you want to close the beach? Well, we know she's at north. Yeah, do you want to close North Beach? Let's close a beach so we can try to tunnel it. Yeah. 
because there's no way she's going to stay. So let's, which way you want her to go, east or west? Or try to get her to go east or west? Well, stop her from going, being tempted to go towards East Beach. All right, East Beach is closed. Okay. New event card. Mm-hmm. Another shark alert. alert! North Beach. <gasps> oh, thank God we closed East Beach. East Beach. <laughs> Two. The East Beach again, gone. Yeah. Uh, what does it say? If the shark's swimmer track is at three or lower, also place more. She but is no. not at three so or lower. So only one person has been placed. Yes. Would you like to eat this person and then leave? I mean, that's an <laughs> option. <laughs> she <laughs> can be... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> but that means she only moves two spaces. Yeah, but she could go anywhere. Oh, We're God. not catching her. We're almost there. We're halfway there. Yeah, we got her once. Oh, I'd say so this. I only really need to eat two more people before. Uh, yeah. Next round. Next round, or and I've got all my abilities. Yeah. All time. Yeah. All right. We are so doomed. So doomed. I'm surprised there are two of those. I am sad I didn't yeah. get to use my feeding frenzy on South Beach when there were four people there. Yeah. I told you that was a good one. Say <laughs> <laughs> You got three people with a feeding oh, frenzy. Yeah, it was, pretty it was good. great. Three people's good. There you oh. go. Sorry. Oh, they were on the card. Thanks. Okay, so... So she has her move silently and her can't be detected with the fish finder still. Yep. She can only eat one person right now. And you have no barrel on yourself. I do not. But right. Brody can drop a barrel. And I can just grab it. Are you guys done moving? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we were it's your turn. Yeah, it's your turn. Okay. My, oh, Good night, friends. Okay. Good night, Pie. Well, you guys were still chatting. So oh, I, I didn't I thought know you, if oh, I you guys were done. I thought Pie was saying done. goodnight to Novocaine. Yeah, she was saying goodnight to Novocaine. Oh, oh, okay. I didn't know if you guys were done with your Yeah, time. yeah, we, okay. we've, we've done so. all that we can possibly do. Sweet. Two shark alerts. Man. Oh, <laughs> God. So I have a question. Yes. Having read the instructions, are these of any use to me in the next act? No. No. Great. They're completely worthless. All right. I've used an ability. Has a person been eaten? Oh, I, I should have marked which abilities I used on which. Yes. Um, uh, for the hang rounds. on. I know what order I did them in, so. Oh. It's the feeding frenzy. God. God, God, God. Okay. It's all... So I assume this this person in the inner tube in North Beach is doomed. Uh, probably. I don't think they're in an inner tube. I think they're just lying there. Just floating. I don't see an inner tube. No, they're just floating in the water. Oh, floating. okay. They're, they're swimming. <laughs> They're still doomed. That person had an inner tooth. Yeah. And they went down early. I just yanked him right out of the middle of it. Uh huh. Just this tube spinning in the, the water. Um, let's see. Where am I now? Is the question. I, I don't know. I wish I did. Yeah, there is. All right. This is intense. Just thank God that the East Beach is closed. It's closed. Thank God for that. Which beach is closed? Thank God we closed East oh, Beach. Oh, that we did close East Beach. Otherwise, we would have two swimmers at it. Yeah. These swimmers are the worst thing. All right. They just keep going in the water. I have What is eaten wrong someone. with these people? Very well. Yeah. Okay, so that's one action. And then she has two moves. And she used an ability. I'm going to assume she used her her anti-fish finder, but there's no reason for you not to fish find, well, I Well, I was going to say, maybe Brody's binocular seven in case she used the silence. Yeah. One of the two could happen. All right, so she was here. Yeah. Here's the thing. Can Brody get you another barrel on that dock? 
is you can go one, two, three, four. You can only do a max of one barrel there for you. Yeah. So that's all I can say. She used an she ability. Didn't do shark. Oh, sorry. Yes. Yeah. Changes the. She light. used an ability, which means that she only moved once. Which means she's here, here, or no, here. No, 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 no. She was here. She, she ate, ate a person. That was then the she used I... an ability. Oh, does the ability count as one of her points? Yes. Oh, I didn't know that. Wait. Doesn't, wait, oh, wait, no, wait. no, it doesn't. It doesn't. It well, because no. I was no. like, no. That, that'd be super okay. lame. So yeah. that's... All right, I'm sorry. You're I, half awake as usual. That's okay. Uh, so, so she's gone. Yeah. Here, 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 she could be anywhere. I'm going to say binoculars. Sure. Binoculars. Oh, no, wait, he has to be on a beach. Oh, right, that's not a beach. Do you want to close a beach? Uh, Which way do you think she went, west or east? She ate him here. Yep. I'll say south beach. What? Yeah. Why? I feel like most likely she's gone around. Okay. One of the two ways, I think she's on the opposite side of the board from where our boat saw her. I mean, she can't get all the way to the opposite side. I agree she would probably move away from us, which would put her in one of these three places here. Six, east, or two. Why six? Well, she could. Oh, okay. You're right. So two or east. Well, does the shark have to use all three abilities? It's only up to, correct, on the thing? Take one, up two, to three. Yep. One, two... Make you right now. Yeah. Yeah. I could have eaten that person and still be at North Beach. Were you closed? Yep. To move. Taunting drop you. a barrel. And then, uh, so that was. I could have used an ability one, to fake two, you out. One, two, three. What do you want to do? Because I'm up to, I'm up to eight swimmers. <laughs> All right, my go. Sure. Pick up the barrel. Yeah. Where are you gonna launch it, buddy? Hail Mary. I trust you. Why? I've missed <laughs> every time. No, you hit once. Hey, That's true. I believe One, in you, Andy. Two, three. No, I can't get to her that way. If she's in two or east, I can't reach her because it takes one to pick the barrel up. Just drop it somewhere near you that's not in your exact location. One, two, barrel. Can she? North, one, two. Yeah. Mm. All right, West Beach. Are you going to launch the barrel in West Beach? Yes, I'm launching a barrel in West Beach. Did I hit you? No. All right, so it's one, two, three to launch it. I'll pick it back up. Four to pick up. Okay. Sure. Uh, All right, you have some movements. Do you want to go grab that one at seven or...? Really quick, I'm gonna move here. One. Fish finder at six. Are you at six? No. Are you nearby, which is north, two, or east? No. Okay. So either she's anti fish finder, which she probably is. Or she went below yeah. the, the barrels. All right, one, two, three, one, two. Uh, where was this person? There is no survivor. Yeah, there's no people. There uh, I thought no you had brought up some kind of survivors. Roberts <laughs> is here for your soul. Oh my God. Okay. The tables. All right. New event card is. New event card. We caught the wrong shark. <laughs> Swimmer at South Beach. All right, South Beach. Uh, closed. Okay. That was uh, that East was my Beach. cousin Billy. And West. Oh, sorry. This, this is your. It's okay. Choice. It's okay. I want this guy doing the backstroke. Move Brody and Hooper to the same dock of the crew's choosing. The shark gets one action, extra action this round. That's it. She gets the ninth swimmer. That's the end of this round. All right. Choose your swimmer. <laughs> no, you guys do your thing. All Move right. to your Move dock. Us both to. Yeah. Oh no, it's Hooper and Brody. You're fine. Okay. You're fine. I want to look through this deck though to see what what <laughs> the division is. Sunfish masquerading the, as a shark. They always the, do. 
Amanda, I mean, it's your watch turn. At one point, and people were like, "It's a shark! It's a shark!" And I was like, Six "That is a whole of cards luck. for us, and two good cards." Yeah. All right. All right. I'm just gonna. Uh, can I? Uh, is it okay to start looking through this deck? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. She's just gonna cool. eat a person card. either at East or West Beach, and that's the end of this. One good card. Bad card. Two good cards. Three good cards. All right. And you know what? Sure. I'm, um... Four good cards. Okay. So Out of... <laughs> there's six good sure. cards I'll be and here. many I'll more be here. bad cards. I'll use my last ability. Okay. Uh -huh. I've eaten someone. West Beach. Well, we completely failed, John. Oh, God. So there were three shark alerts. Four shark alerts. Wow. Shark alert! Four shark alerts. Uh, ben Gardner's boat. If the shark moves through a space, you knock the captain into the water. And you have to spend two actions to get back out of the water. Oh, God. Uh, but now we're on to the second round. We only get three gear cards. Amanda, do you want to review your mo movements? Sure, yeah, yeah. So... Where did you start? So I started here. South Beach. Yep. Okay. And then I ate someone. <clears throat> I got over here. One, two. Yep. Ate someone and ended my turn there. I stayed there. Right. Okay. Um, and then I used my speed burst and ended up going one, two, three. Mm -hmm. The next thing right. ended in two. Um, I didn't eat anyone at that point. Um, and then, or no, I used my speed burst the next turn and ended up coming down to, or coming over here to east mm -hmm. and then went over to six. I ended up because I had to like move and eat. Yeah, and, yeah I needed a whole bunch of movement. Um, and then I ended up at, I ended my turn at four down here and I had eaten someone at North Beach. That's mm -hmm. when you used That's when I used my speed burst. Um, and then I moved yeah. to three. I ended up at three, but I ate someone at West Beach. Mm -hmm. And then I went up to North Beach. Mm -hmm. Ate a whole bunch of people. That was a and frame. stayed there. And then um, we nailed you once. Yeah, and then um, I got someone else at North Beach because uh -huh. someone populated there, so I ate. And then I came back around and stayed in three. That's where I thought it was. And, yeah, and then I couldn't reach her. Um, I ate someone at West Beach. One, yep. two. I ended up, or one, two, three, or one. Two, I ended up being able to get back to South Beach. Yeah, get to South Beach. Oh, you didn't use the anti-fish finder. You used the uh, no. I did move use anti. Through. I did use it. I used out of sight. I don't remember how I did that. Anyways. I yeah. I ended up being able to. My last turn, I was going to be eating someone at West Beach, so it yeah. didn't matter what I was doing. I, I right. used my last ability, evasive moves. So, yeah. can we fit in the second yeah. round? I think we uh, it's a it's nine. almost nine o'clock. Yeah. yeah, let's try it. You wanna? Here we go. We're already not making it over that bridge before it closes, Andy. Yeah. So you ready? Uh, do, do you mind if I clear the board? Go ahead, clear the board. Have I you ate seen? a lot of people. Man, are so you ready for this? We can I put am. all the swimmers away. Swimmers return. At least Brody's son is fine. So these tokens are yours. Oh boy. These are for purposes. I have these some. are ours. Quint, Brody, Cooper. God, there's so much blood already on this ship. Do you guys need these tokens at all anymore? Uh, we will need the meeples, I believe. Okay. Yes, we will but need the meeples. You don't the need the little boats. We do not need the boats. Now we're oh, on this the is wrong. Oh, you just. <laughs> Do you need the fish finder and the binoculars? Uh, I don't think so anymore. Basically, you can't close any beaches. So. The way it's going to work now is we just follow the steps for the round in order. We don't okay. do actions anymore. 
Okay. So uh, basically, this round is the combat round. And I pray to God we survive. And I get 10 shark abilities. And we get three gear. Yeah. Andy. I know, I know, Calm man. Down. It's I'm okay. In. It's okay. It's okay. okay. It all depends on whether or not we can kill the shark. That's the big thing. Yes. The first round is just the warm up. The first half is just the warm up. Now we're ready. <laughs> now we're ready. All right, so. Amanda, if you want to shuffle this up and give her 10 of those. There you go. 10 cards. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, oh, shuffle yeah. them and then give me 10. Okay. That was fun. I ate so many swimmers. That was great. Wait, we get three. Well, we each get two base gear. Oh, oh, okay. And then one other card? No, and... Um, wait, what? You what? Muppets? Muppets? Wait a minute, we gotta pause for Muppets. I mean, there's a short form series, Muppets Now, coming to Disney Plus in 2020. That's another reason for us to get Disney Plus. I'm so redacted to announce the Muppets brand new unscripted short form redacted series. It's called Muppets John Passing Now, instructions. premiering only on Disney Plus in 2020. It's going to be redacted. Oh, you. And best of all, it will feature celebrity guest stars like Redacted. We're so redacted to share more with you on um, Redacted. Here's Thanks the to the lovers, the dreamers, and someone. Here are your Obviously, 10 sharp abilities. The dreamers and you. There are six other abilities that you do not okay. have. Mm. Do I get to see Each these? Each crew member uh, places all of their see. gears. Ba, 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 ba. I have my gear. Face up for combat. <laughs> what a fool. So each crew member gets their two cards. Yep. And then in addition, we get three gear from the gear pile. If you had done, I think, what was it, uh, uh, no hits, we would have gotten 12 cards each, which sounds impossible. All right. So basically, the way this is going to go, Amanda, is... Amanda, it, this is important. You need to know how this works. Yes. This is so cool. All right. I noticed that the boat comes apart. Yes, yeah. and it has hit points. So you'll see various places have two, hit, two different values. If you do one damage to this far, it is damaged and flips over. Yep. If you do two damage it's to removed. black, it's removed. Nice. If I'm you damage it. a section that somebody is in, they fall into the water. <laughs> and then you have the option to eat them, which does yeah. damage to us. We uh, all have five starting health. If you knock us down to six, we lose. I have 17 starting health. Yep. Oh boy. Uh, so, we each get our normal gear. We yep, got and here are the three gear. special gear that we get, which we can divide between us however we like. Let's see. The three gear we got are. What's a resurface token? Is that this? Those yes. are those. So, what's going to happen gotcha. is uh, we're going to have resurface cards. If we can predict where you are, I'm something happens. going to scooch this up so that when the resurface cards flip, we can see them. All right, so you're going to have an A, a B, and a C resurface card, and then we'll use these to mark where they are on the board. We have to predict where you're going to possibly pop up. Cool. The way you designate which one is, the other sides of these have a token. So you pick the one, you, you put it out, and Determine in secret, yeah. All right, so let's look at our gear. I saw it. So Quint has a machete, which does two damage and is a melee weapon. He I'm putting to my, my tokens down here. So okay. And a flare, which he can attach to the shark. While attached... I don't like talking about my flare. <laughs> while attached, at the end of each round, the shark must cards. roll one die oh, yes. and take that many wounds. So I can stick a flare into her and it will continually do damage. Uh, let's each do a Brody card. Just to keep it going. Okay, so Brody has two things. What does Brody have? Brody's got a pistol. After the shark reveals their resurfaced token, you may move your target token to an adjacent water space. After firing the pistol, discard either an ammo or pistol. And you have a baseball bat. Uh, it's two dice. If your attack misses, re-roll both dice. The new results are final. Wow. 
And finally, we have Hooper's gear. Hooper's got a hammer. When attacking with the hammer, the shark evade value is zero. And finally, a rifle. After firing the rifle, discard either an ammo or rifle. And the three gear we have access to... We have some chum. After the shark locks uh, in the resurface token, you may play chum. The shark player must reveal one of the resurface tokens they did not choose. Okay. After you use using the chum, discard it. Okay. We have a shark cage. Before the shark rolls for an attack, you may play the shark cage. You cannot take any wounds this round. After using the shark cage, discard it. I think Hooper gets the shark cage. Oh, God. Well, Just for flavor. For it, flavor, but he also has the rifle, and the last card we got is... Ammo, for use yeah. with a rifle or pistol. Do you want... Brody has the pistol. He I does mean, he have can take pistol. both. Uh, it doesn't have to see. be divided evenly. Before the shark rolls an attack, you may play the shark cage. This cannot take... You cannot take wounds this round. Uh, I'm going to give Quint the chum... Give him the ammo. Give him the ammo. All right, Brody's got the ammo. All right, ready? Dear God. So where do we start on the boat? Anywhere we want. All right, you pick first. <coughs> I'll be up here. Actually, no, I'll be in the wheelhouse. I'm steering. <laughs> I'm driving I'll be the on boat. The back, and Brody's on the tip. Which tip? This one? That one. Okay. No, he's, he's on the tip, the tip of the boat. He has to be in one or the other <laughs> space. <laughs> Why? Because that's how the game works. Okay. All right. Because so if I attack, then like either one, then you would get hit. Oh, yes, so yeah. <laughs> it's okay. All, All right. right. So now we sh reveal the three resurface options. Oh, and I have damage dice. Yes. Yeah. And we, we both also, use damage dice. Yeah. All right. So <coughs> resurface option one or A is up here. B is down here. C is over here. So, uh, you'll get to roll two dice if you choose this location, and one shark fin means what? One dodge, which means if we attack her, she reduces the damage by one. This one is a hook, so that means shark reveal. Reveal the surface token. If no, the no. hook is there, shake off all attack right. weapons. Right, so if she chooses a, a space with the hook, she can shake off anything that's attached to her. She currently does not have anything attached to her, so that's yep. fine. And finally, we have a one dodge at this location. Yep, with three attack dice. So now, you must choose which location to surface at. Yes. Oh my god. That was tiring. And play one action all if optional. If I want to. She's got lots of options. She does. Because she's got ten actions. So sh it's majority wins, right? With us picking our target tokens. What do you mean? Well, the way it works is we pick a target area we're going to attack, right? Yeah. So to do so, we have to put our token there to signify we're choosing that area, correct? Yes, but we can each attack a different area. Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I got that sudden I'm going to use an ability. I want to read about melee weapons. Do they only work if we're in the water with her, or do they work if we're on the boat next to her? That is a fantastic question you should read. Um, All I know is I'm very glad I did not choose to go to the front of the boat right now. are close range weapons. They allow you to roll dice in order to inflict wounds on the shark. Yes, I know that. Okay, I got an idea. I know, I know what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to do here. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Are you ready? If you are using a melee weapon or an adjust attachable weapon, you must be in the same space or adjacent to the water space you are targeting. Okay. <laughs> All right. So. You ready? Uh, let's see. I'm going to, and we can do this simultaneously. There's no reason not to. So this is crew prepares. Move up to two spaces, choose one weapon, and 
use it. So Quint is going to move one and target A with his flare. All right. Hooper is going to B. He's using the hammer. And uh, yeah, he's ready. Okay. And then Cooper, Brody. Brody, I think should go to A with you. Okay. And where is he targeting? A. And he's going to use the baseball bat. Okay. All righty. All right. Shark reveals. Yes. Reveal your resurface token. I am at A. Perfect. You are at A. I have an, I played a shark ability. What is the okay. shark ability? Domino effect. If I damage or destroy a boat space, I apply two hits to one boat space that is adjacent to the targeted boat space. Okay. Yeesh. Okay. So she hits the white value first or the black value first? Uh, she rolls however many dice are indicated on the reveal card, which is two. Two dice. Three. three she hits. gets three hits. This section of the boat is destroyed. Oh my. So it's completely removed from the game. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Shark attack is step six. Yes. We crew attack. We crew attacks first. Yep. So okay. she reveals eligible crew members may attack the shark. Okay, attack. So um, I'm attacking my flare is attached to you, Amanda. Oh. So what does this do? Amanda, do you want to read the card? While attached, at the end of each round, the shark must roll one die and make take that many wounds. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Until you shake off the attached. Yeah. yeah. And you hit her with the baseball bat. Yes. Ow! So you roll two dice. Please. If your attack misses, re-roll both dice. Oh, shoot. Three! All right. Three is not a miss. Uh, she gets one dodge, so you're doing two damage to her. Two damage. Uh, yep. Okay. okay. Now, shark attack. Yes. And attack the boat or a crew member uh, in oh. the water with you. So you attack well, the no boat. Well, no one's in the water. You so rolled yeah, a three. Boy, rolled we already three. cover this. Yep. So we both fall in the water. How could you guys? No! Uh, this bit of the boat is destroyed. How do you get back out of the water? And then she gets a bonus attack. Yeah, I do. Um, I get to apply two hits to a boat space that is adjacent to the targeted boat space. Okay. Uh, which one do you want to hit? The other front or the other one? I'm going to do damage to that. Okay. Right. So, so two damage breaks it but does not yeah. destroy it. Correct. So it is okay. broken. Uh, the chief difference that this makes is that this is now adjacent to that water. Mm -hmm. So yeah. if she's here, yeah. she could attack that space now. All right, now all of these go away. Well, wait, wait, wait. Because now we have... No, wait. No. Shark attacks, roll bonus attack if applicable. If the shark is in the same space as a person in the water, they yeah. get a bonus attack on that person. And I think right. it's just one die. Do I get to attack each of you individually? Yeah. Cool. So attacking bonus attacks. Before going underwater again, the shark may roll a bonus attack against each crew member that is in the water near them, as follows. One at a time, roll one die against each crew member that is in your space or an adjacent water space. Youch. One hit. Who do you want to hit? Uh, I'm going to hit... I mean, you should have declared who you were attacking first. Uh, Brody, because Brody has okay. more stuff. Okay. Nothing. Nothing on Quinn. Okay. okay, great. And we're back to the top of the turn order. So these go away. Yep. And we reveal three more. Woo! C. Ah. B. Ah. Where's A? Can we turn the discard sideways? A. Oh. Uh, Otherwise, they're going to be really confusing okay. sure, sure. for me. Yeah. No problem. Uh, A. A is here. Okay. Uh, now we, you decide where you're going to go. Yep. Shark chooses which of those locations to attack. I feel like we need to use the pistol. You may use the pistol how you wish. You can use Brody definitely this turn because last turn I chose where you Okay. 
All right, I'm going to move. Oh, I should have rolled it because it's at the end of each round, so that should have counted the oh, previous okay. round. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Roll. I'm being fair. Thank, Thank you. One. One damage. That flare is painful. Yeah, well, she can sucks. shake it off by going here and get three attack dice. But only one defense. Who knows? How tough is it? Oh, it's a four. Yeah, that's pretty tough. Who knows? All right, I'm going to move here. Hammer. Target. Boom. Okay. And you wish to use... All right, it takes two attack. actions to get out of the water. So one, two, to move there. And I'm going to shoot at C with the pistol. Okay. And Quint. Um... Do you want to... No, no, if you were going to chum, you should have chummed earlier. It's too late now. It, it, it won't matter this round. Yeah. I'm just going to use two moves to get out of the water. Out of the water. What's my goal here? Kill us. Kill us. Oh, cool. Or destroy okay. the boat. Either Which one Which effectively will work. ends up leaving Our goal you is to kill you. To my, to my tender mercies. Yes. Essentially. All right, mm, so tender. we're locked in. Yep. Oh wait! Oh yeah, I don't. I'm uh, you can't attack, unfortunately. Well, I could, but I can't. I'm not. You're going to attack, bro. I like the very yeah. different types of gameplay here. Oh yeah, that's what interested yeah. me most when I saw the Let's Play video. Andy, I was like, can you yeah. hand me the rest of those tokens that yeah. go? Not the boats, but yeah, those. Because I like the idea that a lot of games nowadays are adapting the uh, the Trail at House on a Hill mechanics. Yeah. Yeah. But are making actually two games instead of making it a scavenger hunt. But it's then very a game. flavorful. Oh yeah. All right. Did the uh, shark just ask for my motivation? <laughs> yes. Uh, so are you done, Andy? Yeah, I'm locked in. I can't attack with yes, Quint. Yes, and? Uh, so shark reveals. Amanda, reveal your location. A. A. <laughs> None of us attacked A, so let's put the shark out here just, just for... Oh, yeah. God. It's going to split the boat. And you did not use an ability. I did not use an ability. Okay. So roll for A. Crew attacks. We Nobody. miss. We used the ammo on the pistol. So that's gone forever. Oh, God. Yeah, I was hoping she was at B or C because the pistol can re aim. Mm -hmm. uh, so, fine. Um, uh, so crew attacks, nothing happens. Uh, Amanda gets to roll. Shark attacks. Two dice. That's a two. Two hits. It's damaged. Crunch. And then she vanishes back under the waves again. Uh, then it's a flare. I have to roll for damage. Ugh. That flare is I gotta get rid of that flare. Crazy stuff. All right. Next round. Okay. Resurface options are A, back here, B, back here. Oh, God. And no. C. Oh, right where we are. <laughs> uh, there's no special shaking off the flares, though, which is good. No. Okay. 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 I mean... Well, first, she locked in. Do you wish to use chum? Yes, I am going to use the chum. So we get to After see the shark locks their resurface token, you may play chum. The shark player must reveal. So that's... I have to reveal one of the tokens I didn't use? Yes. Yeah. One of the two. So, but that's after she locks in. So yeah. she, first she locks in. Yep. She's locked in. Okay. I'm going to chum the waters. So I use up my chum. And she must reveal one of the things she did not use. So she's not in B. She is not in B. So she's A or C. I think she's probably going to try and eat us. Do we move out of this space? Or do we just try and smack her with our weapons again? Well, uh, either way, I'm going to use my hammer and try to hit her here. That's my... Where's my target? There. The hammer, I think, just gets away with the evasion stuff. So I think it's a good lock-in idea. Okay. Uh, then you two should probably eat, kill her with bats and machetes. Yeah, I'm going to use my machete here. He uses the bat. He uses the bat. Uh, here. And we're locked in. 
We're locked in. Crew attacks. Or no, shark, shark reveals. Reveal. A. I am at she A. is at okay. A. Okay. Now crew attacks. So if you want to put your shark out at A. All right. Crew attacks. Blosh, blosh, nothing happens. Okay. Hammer attack. Yeah. Uh, I ignore all dodge. Nice. Yeah. I do no! Your turn. Uh, shark attack. Two so dice. I'm at A, so I get two dice. Three. 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 I'm, I'm, yeah. Oh, it's before you roll, so I can't do anything. Oh, darn. So that destroys this. Yeah. Okay. I am in the ocean. Does that mean I get to attack you? I yep, one die. Now before that, I would like to see whether or not... That's one die, I don't mind. Go ahead. This should be a saving <laughs> sort of thing. A save your life sort of thing. Okay, one, one hit on hit. you. That's fine. All right. The boat is not looking good. No. It's right. taking some damage. All right. Flare. Oh, yes, the flare. That flare. It's the yeah. one. It's doing more damage than either yeah, of us. Yeah, it's doing more damage than you guys. Oh, God. God, I feel like all of the shake-off stuff was at the beginning of the deck. So, A. Useless. Mediocre. <laughs> B. Oh, here you are. Thank you. C. So now we got no chum and no idea where she's going to pop up. Yeah. Oh, God. Now, okay. my question is, if an area was already gone, could she not choose that area to resurface? Or no, she could go there. Because okay. I have abilities that let me do things with adjacent cards. Okay. And There's so also... Um, so, to give you guys an idea of what sorts of abilities there are, I'm going to show you some abilities from what I don't okay, have in yeah. my hand. Um, so, like, there's, like extra strength if the shark damages a boat space that boat space is destroyed instead of just damaged okay there's second helping after an attack that targets the boat the shark may launch a second attack on the boat with two dice the second attack may target the same boat space or a different one uh big mouth if the shark dam damages or destroys a boat space each crew member on that boat space takes one wound so it's things like that, gotcha. um, but some of these do mention like adjacent, yeah, um, or I can knock you into the water, things like that. Uh, yeah, I yeah. Think after rolling for an attack, the shark may re-roll as many dice as they wish. The new results are final. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh All right, boy. So where am I going? I don't where am know. I going? A, B, or C. Either way, you've got some bacon. Hungry for bacon. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let me look at what I have for cards. Oh, God. The Orca. Out of all characters, Quince took no damage so far. Yeah. No. Oh, yeah, she missed when she attacked me. Yes. Yeah. She rolled the blank. So it takes two act one action to get back on? Two actions. So what does that mean? It's two moves. So I, I have picked a, an ability. Okay. What's the last down? I have chosen my space. Okay. She's locked in at one of those locations. First off... I gotta get back out of the water. So okay. I'm gonna go to B. Okay. That's my whole turn. Are you gonna attack? It's uh, it, you can move up to two spaces. Hammer. Okay. And yeah, hammer. Okay. I, I guess the target's only if you use the rifle, right? Yeah. All right. Um, I feel like we should try the pistol again. Then it's gone been, forever. I know. It's gone. Forever. But the boat is almost gone forever anyways. I'd so. say move to A and just try to survive. You can't get to A. It's two moves. We could get to C. Wait, you can't... Dot, dot? That's diagonal. It's diagonal. Oh, diagonal's not allowed. Nope. Like in the other, like in the first act. Yeah. But you were a creature you could of the dive sea. into the water. We can yeah. walk across. <laughs> Tough. I can swim diagonally. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Andy. Yeah. 
You can do it. All right, Brody is going to go to here okay. and shoot at A. Oh, God. If we lose the gun. And Quint is going to go one, two, and attack, so. and attack with the machete at C. So no matter where you pop up, something's happening. Something's going to happen. What you get? Reveal. Oh, All she's right. got ability. Yeah, I have an ability. First so up. Wait, 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 wait. When do we use the shark cage? Uh, before before, I roll. before, before she I roll. rolls. Okay. I am at A. You're going to shoot. Uh, All right, does your so. ability go off before he shoots at you or anything? Is it defensive at all? Nah, it's about damaging both. Okay. Okay, crew attacks. Yep. You roll so two the dice. Pistol, two, two dice. Two evade. Two evade, two dice. Die, rolled two, it's a miss. Pistol's yep. gone. Dang it. All right. So I'm going to attack the boat. Okay. Yep. Uh, what is the roll? And if the shark damages a boat space, the boat space is destroyed. All right, give it a shot. Oh, yeah, that's gone. That, gone. That's gone. utterly gone destroyed. Anyway. There you go. All right. Well, nobody fell in the water, chomp, at least. Chomp, chomp, Our boat is quickly disappearing. Oh, come on. All right. Oh, wait, flare? Oh, yeah. Big numbers. No! Oh, fizzled. No, it's still going. <laughs> <laughs> it's still hey. good. It's still good. Oh, it's gone. All right, here you go. If you show up in A, I'll be surprised. Let it all be spaces in the water. B. Okay. C. Hey! All hey, right. Um, now, crew prepares. Uh, isn't it shark chooses? Shark chooses. Oh, shark chooses. chooses. Sorry, shark yes. Chooses. You take that target off the... Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was his. That was his. All right. Oh, 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 oh! She might be trying to shark off that flare. Oh, where does she shake? At B. B? Yeah. Using an ability. Okay. Rifle to B. Um, move baseball bat at B. All right, machete at B. Machete at B. Put it all at B. I hope we miss. Sure. I hope um, we miss. I reveal my yeah. resurface token. I did go to B. Okay. Um, and um, I shake off all attached weapons. Okay. Yep. So that's gone. The flare is gone. It did some damage. It we did some work. All now attack. Now you get to attack me, but hard target. My evade value is three. Okay. Um, any crew gear cars that affect evade values are still active, but I, I have an evade value of three at the moment. So the rifle okay. has an automatic hit. Okay. So I don't know if that goes That's, through evade or no. It counts as an extra pip on the dice. Okay. Yeah. So roll two dice for the rifle. Three. That My would be a, Wait, wait, wait. Doesn't it get a reroll? <laughs> Oh, after the rifle. Oh, discard no. Discard either the ammo or the rifle. It's the baseball bat that has the reroll. Yeah. All right, so the rifle um, is my gone. evade value was three. Yep. So it was a miss. So it's a miss. All right. Baseball bat. Two dice. Roll. Let's each roll one. Oh, come on. <laughs> one. Three. That's a miss. Yeah. If you miss with the baseball bat, reroll. You're giving them both to me? No, no, fine. Uh, still a miss. All right, and machete. Machete. One two hit dice. automatically. Miss. All right. Man. I'm just a really wily shark, guys. Yeah, uh, man. You roll two dice. This I isn't how it dice. went in the movie, is it? <laughs> oh, hold on. Thanks. Um, no, no, no. Well, I'm not there. One hit. One hit on it. Uh, what is it? It's two. got two, so it's not destroyed. So it, it, does it have to be all at once to yes. destroy it? Okay. Yeah. And then she dives back beneath the waves. Yes, I do. Oh, okay. Well, man, that's three abilities gone. Yeah, we've used up all of our firearms. Uh, we're going to have to A. We're going to have to reshuffle. Yep. A is over here. Shuffle, shuffle. So we're all down to smacking her with weapons, weapons now. 
Did I see the robot? Yeah. Oh, oh. God. If we hadn't totally failed at Amity Island, we'd do, be doing a little better here. Probably. I'm getting the hang of the game, though. Mm -hmm. Okay. B is at the back corner here. And C is at the front corner here. Well, great. She could be anywhere. All right, Amanda, lock in. Thank you. This is a difficult time. She's locked in and she's using an ability. Okay. All right. Where do you think she went, John? So if she chose A, she's got three attack dice and one dodge. That's here. If she chose B, she's got two attack dice and one dodge. She could have gone up here with two attack dice and two dodge. I'm going to stay here. I think you should go to A with Quinn and C with... Uh, okay. Yeah. Just line up along the boat. Line it Bap. up. <laughs> Bap. Bap. Bat. Alright, which one did you choose? I chose A. Okay. I am here. Dun 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 all right, good job, Andy. All right. You got so shark now attack. I'm going to attack the boat. And after an attack that targets the boat, I may launch a second attack on the boat with two dice. The second attack may target the same boat space or a different one. All right. Uh, it's got a four to kill it. Oh, you got all three dice. Oh, gosh, that's right. That's why I went there. Oh, man. Well, that's Five. Destroyed. It's destroyed. Uh, Quint goes in the water. Yep. But I can only attack another boat space. Okay. It's not, it's, this yeah. specifically says another boat space. Is it so. the same number of dice, I believe, right? Two dice. Oh, two dice, okay. Yeah, I get to use another. Which, which one space? would you like to hit? C, uh, which one? It. I'm going to go for C. Okay. Because okay. I feel like that might be easier with two dice to destroy. Okay. So. And, and it is it's indeed gone. destroyed. Gone. It's gone. Oh, boy. This boat is disintegrating fast. How held together it's by it's just... It's not a boat anymore. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> All right. Uh, and you get a bonus attack on Quint. So roll one die. That's right. One, one hit. hit. Out. Uh, so if it's... It, the boat is destroyed, she wins no matter what, yep. right? Okay. All right. Because it's assumed you guys have nowhere else to go at that point. I so. All right. New resurfaces. A. It's actually still on the board. <laughs> B. Not on the board. Oh. Oh. So I Gee, think I, I know where, where she's going. going. I mean, she might not. Well, I can't help at all. Literally, the only one who can help is. So you. Brody climbs out of the water and smacks at this hey. location with his baseball bat. Do you want to get on this I, side? I'm, yeah. I'm looking at cards to see if I have options. Hold okay. On. Okay. Because, okay. yeah, we, we have to decide what's going on. Yeah, she locks in first. Oh, my God. Where's the inflatable? From yeah, she day. might have something that lets That's her attack useful. an adjacent space. May I see our other gear cards we did not get? Sure. Because we had a whole deck of them. Yeah, there's a lot of gear here. Let's see. We had a fishing net. One attack, the shark's evaded is lowered by one. Some more chum. A harpoon gun! It's, it's a three die attack with a first hit. It's mean. Ammo, a lot of ammo. A track spear. Trank spear. Oh, trank spear. If, the, uh, if your attack wounds the shark, the shark rolls one die when attacking this round. A fishing pole. 
While attached, when the shark rolls for any attack, all dice uh, that show a two hit are only counted as one. The canister, which is She's great. chosen an ability. Yep. While attached, if a pistol or a rifle were to wound the shark, the canister explodes. So, John, thinking here. Really? You are at this point? Because I think we're gone. She's using an ability card. I am. She okay. might be trying to fake us out. You go to B and C and just hit an adjacent area? Well, I think I can attack from here into the water here. Like, I can climb out here. Yeah. And, and then, with that. yeah, swing my adjacent. baseball bat there. Sure, if you want to. But I can't get there no matter what because we yeah, have Yeah, just water. climb out onto the back there. All right, climb out there. Okay. I'm done. All right, shark reveals. All right, give me a second. I want to make sure that you're doing that right. Oh, legs are probably asleep. Oh, boy. Baseball bat. Okay, yeah, you can be adjacent. All right. Uh, All right. Which, what did you choose? I am an A. Oh, so you missed. Damn it. You, uh, you missed. I missed. So So we attack and nothing happens. And you attack. Yeah, oh, my, uh, my evade value was three, so... Uh, you rolled two dice? Yeah, so I would have been able to evade your attacks. That's three, that's destroyed. Oof, yep. I fall in the water. Brody, Brody falls in the water. All right. And you get a bonus Brody. attack on Brody. Attack him, end him. You get One. an attack, and you get a hit. Is it two health? Oh, man. Okay. 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 I just need to have the ability to attack these two parts of the boat. Yeah, that's true. A. B. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, she's probably going to attack B. Well, C no, no, that's your choice. Yeah, this C. Our choice. Yeah, she locks in first. Yeah. You had to lock in oh. first. Oh, mm. God. Mm. 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 How much damage have we done to you? I am uh, at nine. Nine of seven, seventeen. Uh, uh, I'm halfway. Eighteen. Basically, yeah. Yeah, eighteen. Eighteen is a count. So yeah, that's not bad. That flare did a lot of damage. That flare yeah. was mean. Yeah. Uh, that was the good. The other attachment being a canister, and if we hit the canister with a bullet, <laughs> it explodes. <laughs> it does a whole bunch of wounds on me. Oh my god, three wounds. Uh, let's see. I wonder why a harpoon gun would deal more damage than a frickin' rifle. Uh, we just gotta start hacking. Hacking, hacking, hacking. Technically, we could just stay on one spot forever. Sorry, Jen, what's more effective than a baseball bat? The, the canister? Nunchucks. Nunchucks, okay. Nunchucks are definitely more... All right, more. she's locked in and I've she's locked, using wait, an ability. I, well, mm, mm, she yeah, uses yeah, special yeah, power. Yep, 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 cool. Okay, I choose C. Andy, you choose. No, uh, fight C. All right, and... And, <laughs> and attack? Yeah. There you go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We're going for that. Sure. All right. What did you choose? I I chose C. Oh, thank no, good. God. <laughs> All right. So we get some attacks. But uh, does your ability make you a hard target or something? No, my ability is making waves, oh. so if I damage or destroy a boat space, all crew members anywhere on the boat fall into the water space in their zone. All right. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to attack with my hammer first. You're so I don't have to destroy it to knock you guys into the water. Yeah. The uh, with the hammer, your defense is zero. Gotcha. One hit. Okay. Why was her defense zero? That's the hammer's ability. Yeah. Uh, when okay. attacking the invade the value is zero. Yep. That's why it's a one die. Okay. Right. Yeah. Otherwise, I have two evade. Machete. So. Two with one extra hit, which so negates your evade. No, no, no. no. Oh, evade is two. two. Evade is two. two. Okay. So. I rolled three, well, yeah. two plus the one, one, so I get one hit. All right. Brody rolls for his baseball bat. Three. So we do one more damage. Okay. You guys are a, chipping away at me. A progressive round. All right. Tense. Before Tense. she rolls her attack, shark cage. Oh, yeah, shark cage. So what does that do? Uh, you may play this. You cannot take any wounds this round. So Hooper, Hooper can't, take, can't any take any wounds? Hooper can't take any wounds. Okay. <coughs> How many dice do you get? I uh, get one. One. 
Uh, it is yeah. a three. Yeah. One, so one it's hit, damaged. so it's damaged. We and all fall, in the water. fall into the water. Okay. So uh, that means I get uh, to attack you. Okay. Well, you can't do any damage to Hooper, but you right. can roll against Quint. That's what I'm going to do. Okay. Two. One. Takes a hit. Ow. Okay. <laughs> Quint is at two hits. I really All right. wish we had that explosive canister now. <laughs> I wish we had John. <laughs> Does that use up that? Uh, yes, the yes, shark cage is, is gone. gone. Cool. Okay. Resurface up. cards. Oh my god. A. Ah, great. Great. There. Perfect. Beautiful. B. Here. There. C. Right where I am. Okay, Let, let's, uh, uh, Amanda. All right, Amanda start. locks in. It's your turn. How many spaces do you guys get to move? If Two. you go into Two. the water, does that count? Like, do you have to use action uh, to get back to get onto the boat? onto the boat is two moves. Okay. So if you try to, basically, if they try to, if you guys here try to go to A, you can't We can't, can't get do onto it. the boat, but yeah. we can, yeah. Cool. Okay. She's locked in. Is she going to uh, use an ability? I'm thinking about it. Oh, God. How many ability cards do you have? Sure, like why five? not? Three. She's oh. got three left. Okay. All right. All right, so Brody. And target here? Yeah. Okay. Brody's going to swing his baseball bat there. Uh, the other, other two, the same thing. Quint. Oh, God. No way, dude. All right, fine. Fine, dude. Fine. Fine. All right. Because I assume she's going to try and destroy the boat. Unless that ability allows her to attack us in the water. <laughs> I don't know. We're swimming around. We're we're desperate now for answers. I went to A. Okay. She's at jump, A. Jump, 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 jump. Uh, All right. So at A, hard? she has two two evade, evade. and two attack dice. Uh, does your ability uh, defend? No. Okay. I will roll my one die for the hammer, and you have zero evade with the hammer. That is one hit from the hammer. I find it weird that the hammer is so efficient. I got, I got one hit? <laughs> yes, one hit from the hammer. Okay. All right. Okay. Machete. Machete. Two dice. Plus one hit. Three, so that's one hit. You guys might get me. Baseball bat. Two hit. Two dice. Oh. Ah. Nothing. Nothing. Wait, but we re-roll. There you go. Nothing. Nothing. All right. All right. So my ability is after the crew attacks, I may move to an adjacent water space. If the shark moves, add two hits to my attack roll. Uh oh. Uh, so you move here. All right. You attack and all of us, or okay. Wait. No. I think she only can attack one person at a time. No. 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 She's been attacking us as a group before, right? Well, she gets bonus attacks, so she's going to get to attack attacks. all three of us with a bonus attack. And you could focus one person and kill yeah. them possibly yeah. this round. Who do you want to kill? feel like that hammer has been doing a lot of damage. Yeah, it has been. Oh, been so, yeah, good. I'm going after Hooper. Okay, you get two hits automatically. Yep. And you roll what for the attack? It uh, doesn't really say. I mean, oh. I went I went to A, yeah, so, so I assume I get two, two dice. Okay, so, so two dice. That is four? a dead Hooper. No, he's at five. He's at five, yeah. He's, at, he's got one health. <laughs> All right. Oh. Now so, roll the one die. One die for each of us. Who's yep. first? Who's first? Hooper. Okay. He survived! Man. All right. Uh, Quint. Two, Two hits. hits on Quint. Bap, bap. Okay. And last one is Brody. One, one hit. hit on Brody. Oh, this is very close now. This is really tight, actually. <laughs> yeah. I, the thing is, as the ship gets smaller, a lot yeah. of my abilities are not as useful to yeah. me because a lot of the abilities are based on getting you guys into the water, but you're already in the water. So. Yeah, we're just swimming around in the yeah. water now. Swimming for it. All right. And I have to wait for a card to give me the ability a. to attack the boat if I'm going to try and get the boat. Yeah. B. Okay, is that? No. Dang it. Oh, oh, oh. C. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I, I say. Where do you think say. she's going to go? Well, here's your shark. Yes, thank you. She locks in now. Uh, she's got three abilities, though, to choose from. If she so chooses. 
She unfortunately, I don't think, can hit one of the boats I yet, can't. right? Can't. Isn't this adjacent to here? It is. The problem is if I don't have an ability that lets me attack an adjacent boat space oh, without attacking a boat. That's what I mean by a lot of the abilities are, if We're you attack a boat, you can attack, you know, it's attack a boat space. You can also then attack an adjacent space. But if there's no boat to attack. But if you're in the water here, yeah. you should be able you're to adjacent this to this one, boat think, space. Right? Can I attack an adjacent space? And you check That's, the rules. Yep, yep. If I'm not, like, it just for being in that space. Right. Sure. Attack can, the boat. You may choose one boat space to attack. You must be adjacent to a boat space you are attacking. Oh. So, yeah, you could choose this one if you wish to. That's yeah, you not can't what I, attack how I here. thought that worked. I thought I had to be on it. Yeah. In order to attack it. Yeah, we've been sort of waffling. Basically, been, when you're I surfacing, have, you're surfacing in the water there. I have been 100% assuming that I had to be on the space to kill the in threat. order to attack yeah. the boat. Yeah. So I've been moving accordingly okay. with okay. that. I was not aware that I could be adjacent Ding. to it to, to attack the boat. I That's thought I had to be day. right on it. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. I suspect she's going to be on B or C. Uh, if she chooses B, she has two evade and one attack. If she chooses, if she chooses C, C, C she has... But she only dice. needs one hit to sink that boat. Yeah. So do we all swim into here and... Well, she has to lock in first. Yes, she does. I ain't swimming nowhere. You're nuts. Maybe we should... Try and climb onto the boat here? I don't know. Maybe we should split up. No! Don't split <laughs> the, the party! party. All right, Have she's you learned locked nothing in. from Explore It? <laughs> you literally cannot split the party. I just, I feel like... Uh, <laughs> we right. need... Need more options for the next round. If, if we're she, fortunate, and I mean extremely fortunate, we might be so, able to hit if something. I, if that was the case, I should have been able, after I moved to that water space, I should have been able to attack that boat. Instead of attacking a person? Yeah. Yeah. And I didn't yeah. think I was able to yeah. do that, do that yeah. so I didn't bother, which is why I attacked Hooper. Otherwise, yeah. I would have taken that out. Yeah. So okay. that would have totally changed my strategy for that round. Oh. So I was like, oh, well, I guess I can't, I can't attack that boat space, so I guess I'll attack people because they're in the water with me. I'll move to, that, I'll move to the water space. So. And she's probably going to go for the two evade. The hammer... The hammer is the only killer. thing. You can get a two hit, and then the machete could get a possible well, Quint thing. Quint is going to go this way. He's going to climb up here. Why? Um, just so that next round he's in a better position. All right, that sounds smart. I'm going to leave Brody here to attack this space. Okay. Is that okay with you? Yes. I just assumed that because you guys had weapons that you could swing them into the next space. No, and that I was in the space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that was how okay. I was, what I was assuming in terms of why oh, yeah, that okay. worked the way I, I assumed it was working. So, okay. all right. Uh, which space did you choose? I chose B. All right, you have two evade. Brody gets one hit. Yep. There you go, Andy. Two. That's a miss. It's a right? miss, yeah, but a we miss. get to re-roll it. Re -roll. Three. One hit. Not One that hit. they have. So yeah, any of the weapons, but mostly the harpoon. Yeah, but they don't have the harpoon, so. All right. Tough. Uh, you may now attack this boat or this character. I'm gonna attack the boat. Okay. Uh, that is two dice. Yes. She chose B. Yes. B is one. Oh, one die, one die, one die. But yeah. it's destroyed. Dead ship. So we are on the last little remnant of the ship here, except for Brody. All right, we have to deal three hits to be able to win. And she has four potential. This is areas. becoming a nail, nail biter. A nail biter. All right, so A's A. Go here. Yep. With two evade and two dice, that's pretty strong. That that could well be the end of the game there. You get to attack me first, though. Yeah. Yes. And how many hit points do you have left? Three. Uh, three. So you could take me out before I can destroy the last remnants of your boat. It's a nail biter. It's real tough. Oh, there's two adjacent spaces. Uh huh. 
Alright. C. The one you're on. Alrighty. Lock in Amanda. Literally could not be any more difficult to choose. And they're all two of eights. Yeah, I feel like we can't do enough damage to kill her unless we concentrate our power the and only thing happen to hit the place where she is. If you rolled your machete and you hit her with two two side dice, yeah. you would win. Aside with from that, all right, you've chosen your location. I have. Would you like to use an ability? No. None okay. of them are actually useful in this situation. They're all about getting you guys in the water. All right, John. And if I destroy that, you're in the water anyway. So right. and if I lose. destroy that, I win. I so, yeah. yeah, these are, at this point, a um, moot. I wish we had chum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Andy, what are you feeling? You think she would jump on the location, or you think she'd go adjacent? God, she could be anywhere. Um... Because if we split up the damage, we're screwed. Yeah, we have to hit her. We have to hit. No um, matter what. I think she'd go to B because that's where we aren't. Well, we're also not at A. Oh, no, Cooper's at A. He's at A. So Brody could go swim, 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 attack. And then we could just concentrate all our firepower on B. You're feeling B of all the letters, correct? That's what... That's... I mean, this is just a, a, a guess. guess. All right. She could be anywhere. I'm going to trust Andy's intuition. I'm going to put my faith in Andy. And I want to know how it well went. founded. Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> There's a chance we could win there this, There is a chance you could win this. Hammer I first. You hammer. can take me out at the last minute. Let's see. You can do it. Let's see. One. One damage from the hammer. Okay. I and it does. It, I, it yeah. Ignores negates the, evasion. Okay. All so, right. All right. Brody with the baseball bat. You, you need two bat. hits on me. Two hits. Three. That's one hit. One hit. All right. And finally. Quint with the machete. You could take it. You could do it. You could do it. Three. Oh. Yeah. Oh. So that's it. Amanda rolled the two dice just to see if you would have destroyed the boat. Oh, she had it. She yeah. had she it. She destroyed the yeah. boat. So. If, wow. I, if you guys had missed one of those, one hits, of those hits, I would have taken... That if was, we had targeted the wrong area, yep. we would have been dead. Yeah, so my last three cards were ramming speed, making waves, and domino effect. Okay. So domino effect is if I damage yep. or destroy a boat space, I get to apply damage to another boat space. Making waves is if I damage or destroy a boat space, you fall into the water no matter where you are. Yeah. And ramming speed is I can move to another water space after you attack. And oh, I was okay. like... So that you're glare, getting attacked, so yeah, it doesn't matter. Glare matter. Saved that the day glare, for us. Yeah, really took me down a lot. Those hard things of my god, they are such a good card. The hard target. Hard target. Hard target was such really good. good. Um, and extra strength was really good. Second helping was awesome. Uh, so. I definitely want to play this again sometime. Yeah, this was that great. Was, oh, that was such so much fun. fun it, and it ended up game. being a lot tighter than <laughs> yeah. I expected. I went in there with like all. So, but all that to me says. On the flip side, where I was able to eat a lot of swimmers, mm -hmm. like that's not a game breaker. No, like no. that evened the playing field coming into this side of it. Yeah, for me. So, for reference, chat, Amanda would have won that game if she had known she could attack an adjacent space. Yeah. Yes, if I had known if I could attack, had attack an adjacent instead space, of attacking Hooper, I would she have already taken that space. That out. That she would, would have, have won the game a, a turn ago. Because I was, yep. just, I, I knew that you guys had a lot of hit points. I was like, there's no way I'm taking all three of them out. It's easier yeah. for me to attack the boat. Um, so I was focusing on the boat. I yeah. didn't realize that I could, I could focus on a, a boat space that I wasn't in. I was wondering if there was a thing that would deal more damage to a character. I, I, it is big mouth. Uh, yeah, big mouth, big mouth. I didn't have any of in my hand, yeah. so it didn't. Big mouth's end a good. Uh, yeah. Well, that was. So much fun. Oh my god. Yeah, that was great. Gosh. Okay. I really, I do like how close it, it came. I it actually, was not a foregone conclusion that I was going to win that. Nope. I think I'm going to actually pick up a copy of this. This is really good. This was fun. A lot more fun than I thought it was actually going to yeah. be like this set up. This was really good. God, I love the two act structure. Yeah, I really do. Good. 
Uh, and the gameplay still had very like similarities where there's hidden information. You guys don't know where I am. Ooh, you have to, to put all the other tokens. They're in, They're a, in a baggie. Right that's in the in the box. Box. Oh, there it is. Okay. Here, Here are the tags. Yeah, there's a teeny tiny bag. I guess that can be the tags. Yes. Yeah. But my God. And maybe the attack dice. I don't know. I feel like this is a good way to balance a very strong character against. Yeah. Uh, a group of characters who can do a lot but can't coordinate completely. <laughs> Man, in the first half, that one which dragged us the fake shark sighting. That was that so funny. Away, shark sighting. I was like, oh yeah, sure, you guys go way over no. there. <laughs> Amanda, where's your other two targets? Oh. We need one more standing in that corner. I was keeping them down there so I could see them and I wasn't constantly yeah. Yeah. like flipping yep. them up to look at them. Uh, that worked well. That was great. That game's fantastic. Grab a copy of that. Recommendation. Yeah. Solid. So yeah. much fun. Definitely good. And fun for me, fun for you guys. Like, <laughs> no hard feelings that you guys won. That was a well-deserved victory, oh guys. Oh, my God. That, that's, the, that's also what I like about the, the dice too. production yeah. games. Uh, there's a small bag for the dice. I don't know where it went. I thought it was on the table. Oh, I, I used, used that for tokens. Oh, okay. Because so there were a lot of tokens. The dice. The dice, I feel, are, are less likely to go missing than yeah. a whole bunch of the little swimmers. Oh, my God. Maybe so. I can fit the dice into this bag. I bet you can. Uh, so next week, next week. Lobster of Revenge will be joining us. Yeah, we should we'll definitely do some something folks. that can take a lot of people. We'll figure we it out. We don't know how many folks we're going to have. I feel like maybe Benny will be joining us. Oh, Might be. okay. So. Yeah. There, were, there was Friends email and family. talk about such things. So. Oh, there's another big bag. Oh, that might be. I think that's the for the character. Yeah. Cards and maybe the booklet. The, oh my the little God. hidden. Yeah, that thingy. Oh. That was good. That was great. Well, thank you. Thank you both for joining us. Woo! That was a fun game. Thank you, thank chat, you chat, for hanging out with us while we played that. That was a lot of fun. Um. Relatively simple. Once we got going, we understood yeah. the rules mm -hmm. a little better. The actual mechanics just adjacency were, yeah. during fighting on the boat was a little bit confusing. I thought that I had more limitation than I had, yeah. which made sense to me because the the shark is very powerful. So I was like, obviously, I can't hop onto the boat. So yeah. you know, yeah. I may, I must like need to be certain a certain distance. So yeah, I as the boat becomes more damaged, I was like, wow, that. The, as the boat becomes damaged, that limits a lot of how I can attack because I basically have to only. I was thinking, wow, if I if those cards don't come up with those spaces, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm I can't attack. I'm gonna have to refocus my efforts on attacking them instead of the boat, mm -hmm. which is what I started doing. Right. So, oh well. Oh well. It was. It, was, it, it came down so close, though. I I'm kind of glad that it came down that close and that you guys did it. That was so in good. In killing him in the water. Yeah. Then we wouldn't have had wouldn't that have hammer. Had the hammer. Yeah. So had like lost. too few, fewer hits on you. Yeah. So yeah. Oh god. Close, yeah. close game. A lot of Real fun. Real good. That Thank was so cool. Thank you for joining us tonight, folks. Thank you all so much. That was uh, great. Stay and, uh, We'll see you next week. Yeah. Stay out of the water. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Don't feed the plants. Very different.